Hello, travelers. I'm Chris. Welcome to Lore Spire. Sorry for that little fake out uh, beginning that we had there. Uh, appreciate everybody who was uh, waiting for us. Sorry that things didn't uh, go right there. Um, for some reason, I had no game sound, and I thought I had no microphone sound, but then I found out that I think y'all could hear me. It was just the game sound that was off. So, I had to do some weird shit that I'll have to figure out and undo later um, to get it to work. Uh, but you should be able to hear both me and the game now. If you can't, please let me know, but you should be able to. So, we're going to be starting a new playthrough on hard difficulty, and we will be playing the last of the Sarkorians DLC. Um, appreciate Randall, Matt, Blackula, Malphus, and Akito the Geek for um, all showing up so early. How have you been, Akito? You're right, it has been a while, buddy. Gonna play Phantom Brigade? That's cool. Never played Phantom Brigade before. Um, been looking forward to playing uh, the last Sarkorians DLC for a while, though. Hopefully the shifter class is pretty cool. It's definitely what we're going to be playing. But uh, more so than the new class, I'm actually more excited for the actual content of the DLC. Um, which I have a feeling we won't get to experience until Act 3. Possibly later. Hello, Mr. Hand Pink Waving Zanrak72. Wish I had a pink hand to wave back at you. Um, so I was looking through the different uh, shifter archetypes earlier. I did not get to spend as much time as I wanted to on it today um, because of, you know, life happening and whatnot. Um, but uh, anyways... The the actual character cards for them were a bit disappointing. I actually don't think the class is going to be as good as I had originally thought. Um, I don't know. After looking at it, I think it's definitely going to be the Fiend Flesh Stalker or the Dragon Blood Stalker that turns out to be the best. The Rage Shaper, they're their uh, slam ability that can knock everybody down is limited to one time per shapeshift, I believe it was. Um, so other than that, it's just like a shapeshifting barbarian. So not a whole lot there. And that was the one I was the most excited for. Um, and then Child of the Manticore actually does seem pretty sweet, uh, especially because, as I understand it, the attacks that it gets are pretty freaking far like you got a nice range on them but as far as i could tell you're only ever going to get up to four attacks and unless the damage on those attacks just gets absurd which i'm not don't see how it would like that's just not going to be as good as you know somebody's getting nine or ten attacks most of the, most of the time I don't know. It, it might average out to be about the same because you don't get the cumulative uh, neg minuses to um, to the to some of your attacks like uh, the other ranged classes do. But I still feel like it's going to come out to be less powerful than I had in originally anticipated. Um. Anyways, yeah. Like I was saying, I think the Dragon Blood Shifter is probably actually going to be the best. Um, mostly because being able to transform into a dragon is really, really powerful in and of itself. And the Dragon Blood Shifter is one of, I think, two of these. Right? One, two. Okay, three of them. The Fae Form Shifter and Child of the Manticore also do not lose defensive instinct, but the other three do. And I think that that's definitely one of the most powerful abilities here. Um... So, anyways, those are just kind of my thoughts uh, so far whenever I looked through it. Haven't played it yet. Um, 
Anyways, let me see what y'all are thinking. Uh, Keto the Geek says that Phantom Brigade was announced years ago. Epic bought the PC exclusivity rights, and Steam just got the ability to sell it since the year for Epic ran out. Also finally beat the Baldur's Gate 3 beta. Well, I gotta say... Uh, congrats on beating the Baldur's Gate 3 beta. That's definitely awesome. Um, you know, in what, five... Five months and three weeks or so, you'll be able to beat the uh, Baldur's Gate 3 itself and not just the beta. Definitely, definitely looking forward to that. That's going to be awesome. Um, but yeah, anyways, congrats on uh, beating the beta there. And um, yeah, maybe we'll have to check out uh, Phantom Brigade sometime. Hey, what's up, Lord Boven? See, Matt's already playing the Manticore and uh, having fun with it. Mm. Xanarex72 says dragon for sure. Uh, that is a good point, Yomogami. Um, some of them do specifically state that uh, mythic abilities uh, affect them in a certain way, which is actually cool for them to to put that in there. I never, I didn't see any of them that uh, looked like they were effective, it affected in a way that was like overpowered or anything by any mythic abilities. Um, so yeah, probably going with Dragon Blood Shifter there, like I said. Hello, Igor! I go, 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 go. Are you doing a new boat run or new story save? It's a story save. Um, don't think the boat run gets to experience the, uh, the last Sarkorians DLC. So we're gonna go a full playthrough, and I was actually thinking of maybe making this like a full, full playthrough. Like, we'll do all of the DLCs and the, um you know, the, the length of the actual base game itself. Um, because we haven't actually done the Midnight Isles DLC. Well, we'll do all of them except for Through the Ashes because that's completely separate. You can't have your char your main story character play through that. So all of them except Through the Ashes because we haven't done the Midnight Isles through the story, de um, through the story path yet, only as the standalone. Um, so yeah. I think maybe we'll do all the DLC that it makes sense to do with this uh, playthrough. So, anyways, Dragon Blood Shifter. Uh, I don't know. I was thinking of going either Legend or Demon. That's kind of where my head is at for that. Um, as far as races go, kind of feeling half orc a little bit. We want to go straight awesomeness though, then probably ASMR. Um, and probably ASMR Dumpier or Tiefling. Oh, so you've already gotten a good ways in. What, uh, you want to share your bugs with us, Igor? So we can, uh, prepare appropriately? I believe Unsung has already, um, has already started that, Igor. Or at least he put in the Discord earlier that he's already started that character. So we don't want to rip him off. And the, the stone effigy, or wild effigy, excuse me, um, archetype is... I don't know. I didn't like it either. I don't know. It might be better than some of these, I think. Maybe. Might be. But losing defensive instinct sucks, especially just trading it for... Um, 
some armor plating. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think that's a very good trade-off. The chance to ignore critical damage, that, that's, that's pretty good. That is pretty good. That's kind of like me. I don't know. I think we're going to stick with the dragon blood. <laughs> yeah, whenever I saw the extra crit damage for the claws. Oh, crap. One second. I think this is my son's doctor. One second, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back, I'm back. Yeah, it was my son's doctor or the hospital that the doctor works for, just um, calling to confirm his uh, appointment with his specialists tomorrow, so hopefully that goes well. Hopefully. Don't know why that is not working, but it's annoying me. Ha! Ah, it's working. No more annoyances. Hooray, hooray put that right there for now and uh, maybe move it a little bit later. Um, yeah, what I'm looking for is strength and wisdom. I feel like that's strength, wisdom. I feel like that's what we want to go with. I thought about dipping like um, a bunch of classes to get our AC and our stats really ridiculous, but I decided we're probably not going to do that unless we do go legend and then we probably will. Um, but we're definitely not going to do it early either way. Um, yeah, I don't, maybe, maybe, maybe there's, And they're like a, yeah, let's go with dexterity and wisdom, I guess. The plume kith, Garuda blooded. Can't believe they don't have a strength in wisdom. What the hell? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is that the base ASMR? Because I didn't even, no, that's wisdom and charisma. Yeah, I will not be a bringer of the laws, by the way. I am not, uh, definitely not a bringer of the laws. Not doing that. One of the yeah, intelligence instead of wisdom is yeah, wisdom instead of charisma. Maybe, maybe. Let's see what our stats come out to, and then we'll have a little better idea.
feel like strength is going to be more important. Let's just go with Angel, I guess. We'll be an angelic demon. That should be awesome, right? Um, that's probably good. It's just hard to do that. Like, why do I need that much charisma? I don't think I do. All right, let's go with it. We're going to go with it. Not a bad idea, Igor. Throwing in a bite attack, not a bad idea. Uh, no, I don't think we're doing a Lich playthrough. Thank you for reminding me about the bite attack that the Motherless gets. Let's see what stat bonuses the Motherless gets real quick. Um, boss spawn. We're looking at strength and wisdom. All right, everybody. Igor is the hero of the uh, stream so far. Very, uh, very good work there, Igor. It is most certainly appreciated. And we're just going to go ahead and go with the classic pickpocket. We're going to be dumb as hell. That's all right, though. We don't really need to be smart, right? I think that'll work. the heck is this you can invoke your aspects minor form longer than most add your wisdom bonus to the number of minutes per day that you can use your shifter aspect ability to assume a minor form and whatever i don't think we'll need that uh let's see we're already gonna have claw attack i don't think we need to bump those Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> that was pretty good, Malfus. ASMR is my go-to. I mean, come on, they come with a flashlight. Yeah, pretty good, pretty good stuff. Yeah, well, the, the bite attack is too good to pass up on, and it actually has the two stats that we want the most, so... Um, or that I want the most, at least. Sorry, Random. Sorry, Malfus. Yeah, I dumped Acolyte instead, Xanrax. And yes, Thales, we are we are at it again. Uh, I'm sorry, this is taking me uh, way too long. I know. Um, you know, I think we're just gonna go ahead and take a weapon focus, anyways. It's been a long time since I transformed into a dragon with any regularity. But I believe most of the dragon's natural attacks are claw attacks, right? Like they've got claw attacks, a bite, a tail, and wing attacks. And I think claw and wing both have like two, two attacks each or something like that. They don't have wing attacks as a dragon? I thought they did. Well, we're gonna we're gonna wait then. We're gonna wait on a weapon focus because Yeah, it's a little bit unfortunate. So for now, how about we just take Damn, there's not any good feats to take at level one with this guy. I mean, I guess we could take something now, like shake it off so we don't have to take it later. We could try this extended aspect. Maybe it's actually good. I know we need blind fight. At some point, I'm going to take that. And we're probably getting combat reflexes at some point. Yeah, I guess we could always respec too if we needed to or wanted to. I guess. All right, we're gonna take a weapon focus for claws right now, as you suggested. Ah, draconic aspect selection. Do we want to be metallic, chromatic, or universal? Chromatic it is. Keep relieval looks pretty good. I think I like the um, armor that they start off with, at least. That's pretty good.
terrible hairstyle. Yeah, I think that's good. Horns. Eh, let's go with the little horns on this one. I think I'm good with that. Oh, yeah. That looks pretty damn good. Come on now. You can't tell me that didn't look awesome. That looks awesome. I think I'm even good with the colors that they gave us, the kind of brown and black, so sweet. Let's do it. You should have run. Let's move. All I see is blackness. Yeah, Veshka. See if we can find a cool uh, da 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 da. Mm. That's pretty good. We do have a couple of actual tiefling photos down here. Let's see. We have a couple of them that might fit pretty well. Actually, I think we have one that fits really well. Ah, oh, that one's my favorite. Everybody probably remembers. Very nice. We are playing hard difficulty. Hard difficulty. Let's shred them. Eh. Really did not want to use that one again. I think we've used it about four or five times, but it's definitely the best one. Yeah, screw it. We're going to go with it. We've never actually beaten the game with it, I don't believe, so this can be a first. Wherever my legs carry me. Hmm, maybe we're gonna change that voice. Me. I stand with me. We cannot be let us be out of my way. No, miss. With grace, or I won't take that. None shall escape. Yeah, let's go with this instead. I lead, you follow. I don't know, actually, if you look at the appearance. Like, we've got some red in there, and then we've also got the black. Like, I think that looks better than if we just went with, like, um, all all red or all black. Like, see, that, that does not look as good. I feel like that looks freaking awesome. I mean, am I wrong? That looks better than just the all red, right? Pretty sure it does. Heal me quickly. I 
All right, let's uh, let's get this on. See how uh, see how this works. Hello, Caladian. Um, have you played much of the uh, my, my, DLC yet? I know we got a mix of people here, some of whom have not touched it yet, and other of you square. have uh, played it off for else like, oh, at least some amount of time today. And, in and there's that bitch, Darren. Make room, everyone. Team. Yeah. All right. If Always anybody hurt. cares to listen Leader to any of this, let me know, and I can stop speeding through it. But. We've literally gone through all of this now, who are you? several dozen times. I don't remember seeing Probably you before, more than that. And I have an excellent what? Oh, My and dear prelate. good idea, Yomogami. Anybody who's not already done so, please like the stream, thumbs up. You know, give us uh, of pain. give us that Cast thumbs up. Definitely helps us out. Definitely appreciate it. If you have not subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe. That also helps us out immensely. And if you're over on Twitch like uh, Collision, then, uh, you know, give us a follow. It's definitely appreciated. It definitely helps. Definitely love it. We're actually getting close to 100 followers on Twitch, so uh, thanks to everybody who has been uh, following us over there. Uh, definitely awesome of you. Oh, when did they add that? You couldn't do that before. Nice. That's one of my favorite things about navigating in Pillars of Eternity is that it kind of lets you turn your party just by doing that. Um, so, very nice, very nice. Anyways, continuing on. What? No weapons? You didn't give me any weapons? Boo. That's all right. Why is that all right? Because we don't need weapons. We always play the other games. Let's do this one this time. Yep, time to get drunk before the uh, raid. Ruh row. Yes, Igor, we went with the Thief Link and we cheered your name for suggesting it and reminding me to do so. All right, you were the hero of the stream for a few minutes there. Mortal Nap must nap her job at the Lord of Locusts. Let's do it. A mortal gnat snaps its jaws at the Lord of Locusts. Behold the death I saw. 
you know, they, they've improved the graphics so much for that that opening cutscene there where Discari and the cultists attack that it almost looks like an actual cutscene at this the point. Silver Dragon. I remember whenever the game first came out, like it looked pretty much just like this. Like, not really a cutscene at all. It was just like the normal graphics that you have whenever you're traveling around on the, and navigating the map. And, and whenever you would go to fall down the hole, the Discari makes like for like the last three to four seconds of the clip, like you'd just be standing floating in midair like Wiley e. Coyote, um, chasing the Roadrunner or something, and then you'd finally fall. <sighs> But they've, oh, holy they've got it looking of... much, much better now. Hey, hey, stay with me. If that's all that matters now, we, you don't want to help, fine. That's right, I don't. Uh, damn it. Yeah, things are looking grim enough, but don't lose... If yeah, it's none of your business. Uh, I lead, you follow. Gotta get used to wrath controls and not pillar of eternity controls, although I can thank pillars of eternity Onwards. for giving me that. So thank you for that. Well, I wonder. Options. Damn. Yeah, this is a popular stream tonight, Adam Craig. Uh, for sure, we got some new class hype going on. Um, which is awesome. Hopefully the new class kicks ass. Um, but yeah, this is the first time since the uh, Midnight Isles DLC challenge that we've had, you know, 25 plus people in here on stream. So that's freaking awesome. Thanks everybody for uh, making it. And like Yomogami said earlier, give us a thumbs up. Help us get the 30. Help us get the 35. Thumbs up, subscribe, like, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's make some all-time high numbers during this thing. That would be awesome. Um, enemy information in combat. Sorry, I was just checking to see if maybe... Ah, oh, well, it doesn't matter. Let's go. Uh... Oh, come on. I, I am armed. My arms are my arms. All right. Oh, there's the box. For some reason, that looked like a barrel to me. I guess we do not actually want to miss that, though. Now let's get a move on. Who's there? Really? <laughs> Come on, let's keep moving. We know you killed whoever that is. Even though it's not as super obvious as some people would have you believe. But it is pretty obvious. All right, pretty good, uh, pretty good damage so far, huh? Not bad, anyways. Yep, let's go ahead and get our other dragon scale there. Let's We're gonna the need that. The heartbeat quickens. The inheritor, guide my blade. Oh, so we've been just punching. Oh, wow. Nice. Did not notice that. I heed the voice Hooray of the for spirits. punching. There we go. That should be better. You are today's Do not fear. Do not waver.
Hmm. Okay. Has the Nebbia always had sneak attack damage? I don't remember her having sneak attack damage. I lead, you follow. They will break against our resolve. The fun fact, the NPC that, um, I guess, uh, Camellia totally did not kill is actually the plot hook NPC from the original adventure. I have no freaking clue what that means, Igor, but it sounds interesting. It definitely sounds interesting. Given its source, I'm just going to believe you. When do up? When? The do-gooders here to save our mongrel soul. Wait, agreed. Oh, come on, we can't kill him? Len. Yeah. All right. Well, All right. I found Marguerite you uh, or something. Open your heart to me. <laughs> that would there? be a mistake, Camellia. That would be a mistake. Onwards. Now, what is that? Wow, I do not remember her doing sneak attack damage before. Yeah, I guess you can tell that it's been like six months since I've done this, aside from the one time I did it like a week and a half ago. Um, let's see here. Yeah, we better succeed. We got all kinds of willpower. That. What did you do? I know you're willing to yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, people. Yes. Yeah, we're we're awesome. We know it. We know it. What do we have here? Don't need you to tell me. Uh, real quick. Yeah, I don't like that. Let's put you up front. You back here. You can go there. Wham, bam. Thank you, madam. I think we're probably good to go. Okay. The mongrel did it. Hooray, the mongrel. Thanks, Lan. You're so awesome, Lan. Thanks, Lan. You're so awesome, Lan. Yet another obstacle. So this one right here could be a little bit difficult. And we probably don't want you to die. Um, so yeah, let's just... That's probably good enough. What's on your mind? I wonder. No one stands in my way. I'm thinking red dragon aspect. Let's try that. Go for their high tough pieces. Oh, so this is how look at that. All right, so we uh, we turn on the aspect, and uh, that seemed to up our damage significantly. I we were we were hitting double digits there, so that was pretty nice. Thanks, Lan. You're so awesome, Lan. Move out. Oh, hey, Internet Andy, we went with the uh, dragon. Um, what the heck was it called? Dragon Blood? Uh, yeah, Dragon Blood Shifter. I think it 
probably, I don't know, at least from just looking at it, it seemed like maybe the best. Head on. A lot of the other ones uh, lose the uh, wisdom to AC bonus ability, which I don't like. The Manticore seems like it might still be really good. I just don't see it being as good as most ranged attackers since it only gets four attacks. Could be wrong, though. Could be wrong. But uh, anyways, the dragon seemed like the strongest, so we went with the dragon blood. Some of the other ones definitely look more interesting, though. I lead. Like the you wild follow. effigy uh, archetype. That one looked pretty sweet. We will win this war. And the rage shaper. I don't know. That was the one I was most excited about, but they limited his knockdown ability slam or it's, I guess I should say, uh, to one use per shapeshift. So that knocks out of a lot of the usefulness uh, there or overpoweredness. Without that, Onward. seems like it's just kind of mostly like a, a barbarian. What's that there? They will break against our you resolve. You won't survive me. <laughs> All right, we're going to go ahead and turn that off now because I don't want to be wasting it later. Let's go. Yeah, the Rager one, I don't know. Definitely the one I was most excited for before Andy. Um, but like I said... Uh, them limiting that slam to just one time per and it losing the uh, wisdom bonus to AC like those two things I was just kind of like nah, I'm going to stay away from that I don't know I think the manticore one seems really awesome it's just move out I don't know I think the dragon one's going to be better especially as a demon or a legend I think we definitely have to go one of those two paths. Well, we don't have to, but I think we're definitely going to go one of those two paths. Well, let's take a look. Uh, Igor said that it would be pretty dope if the Dragon Shifter could be used for the Dragon Disciple requirements. I mean... Yeah, I don't see how it's going to help with any of that. Yeah, Dragon Disciple isn't going to help with any of that. You gotta be a sorcerer, a witch, um, a wizard, or an arcanist. Well, you, you got to be an arcane caster. There are other arcane casters too. But you got to be an arcane caster to be able to uh, to get here with this. So um, definitely no way that the dragon shifter is going to help with that. But that's all right. That's all right. All right. So now we're going to get our wisdom bonus plus one to our AC and CMD. Or excuse me, the plus one doesn't come until fourth level. But we should get the uh, wisdom bonus immediately. 
That'll be making us uh, much, much hardier. Let's, uh, let's give ourselves a perception check at least. Then Sila. No. You're not getting points in world. There we go. That's better. Yeah, mobility, trickery, sure, why not? And... Oh, right, that's all she gets. Never mind. Yeah, I actually like... Uh, one, one cool thing that I did see, uh, Matt, is that... Uh, one of the uh, wild shapes you can make as the base shifter or some of the other archetypes, not the one that we chose, but you can actually shift into a Wolverine. I thought that was pretty cool. Like, I almost wanted to go with the base type archetype or one of the other archetypes that could um, wild shape into that because they do have some pretty cool wild shapes there. Like, you can wild shape into a dinosaur or a Wolverine, a tiger, a mastodon. I don't know. There's about 10 different things. So it's not just the the normal stuff that uh, that you see with other classes, which I thought was pretty cool. We're gonna take protective luck here. Hey yo, Jared MHD into Hizzy. What is up? What is up, my friend? It's been like nine years since I've seen you, so nice of you to stop by, sir. Definitely appreciate it. How you been? How you been? Yeah, yeah, that's true. Um, I just, damage resistance in this game, at least to me, means basically nothing. Um, and plus two natural armor is kind of nice, but you know, you can get like, the, uh, the wisdom to AC also comes with a separate plus one bonus. So, I mean, if you get 20 wisdom, you're talking about plus nine to AC. Uh, whenever it maxes out at level 18 or 20 or whenever it is. And you can get way above 20 to Wisdom. Um, so anyways, yeah, I think that's definitely one of the stronger things here. Pretty sure we're going to dip Instinctual Warrior at some point too to see if it allows us to get double our Wisdom bonus to, to AC if we do that. Because if we can, that's going to be pretty freaking sweet. And then that's whenever we go Legend so that we can still max out the Shifter class at 20 levels. Um... Anyways, that's kind of, you know, my preliminary uh, plans or ideas for what we're going to be doing here. Um, sorry, I just... I like turning him into a wandering marksman too much. Plus, having a pet is pretty nice. And the shield maze. Um, so yeah, mobility's good. You're an uni and struggling? Well, I'm sorry to hear that, sir. I am sorry to hear that you're struggling. Hopefully we can take your mind off of your troubles for a few hours. I think we're gonna go with the classic Smilodon here. Actually, no. Let's go with, because everything can trip now, or almost everything can trip now. Let's go with the Mastodon. Where's the Mastodon? Pretty sure they can trip now too, if I remember correctly. Uh, yeah. That's what we're going with. I'm going to take Hurricane Bow and... Wendy, you don't really matter. I am yours to command. 
So we'll just uh, remove your gear. Not that you really have any gear. And we're good to go. Head on! Uh, we were discussing mystic, possible mythic path options earlier. And pretty sure we're going demon. Like, almost completely for sure, unless somebody can talk me out of it. And then there's a good chance that we take legend whenever it comes time for that. Lead on. We'll have to see, but yeah, pretty good chance that we take legend um, at the beginning of Act 5. There's a Nevia Dira. Yeah, let's trade. Do not really need most of this stuff. Hmm. I'm gonna take the potions. I do want mage armor. Take that, we'll take that. Take some scrolls of bless. Guess we can take one blur. And that's probably all we need, right? Pretty sure it is. Oh damn. Well, apparently that's too much. There we go. I all right. need you follow. We could, like, run around this place gathering up all the junk that's in sacks and whatever else. But I feel like y'all don't want to watch me do that. And I've done it so many times, I'm pretty sure it only adds up to, like, 20 copper or something. Or, uh... Sorry, you're probably going to hear me say copper a lot because I've been playing Pillars of Eternity for the last 10 days, about 4 to 7 hours, 8 hours a day. Now, the first thing I see when I wake up is your hideous face. Not the best start to the day. That's funny. Your mom said the exact same thing to me yesterday morning. Well, now that we've exchanged pleasantries, want to call it a draw? Yeah, whatever. Let's go. Um, I don't know. Maybe Gold Dragon would would do well. To be honest, that's like the one path that I've not done anything at all with. So maybe that's a big reason for why. Um, but I don't know. Demon just kind of fits what I wanted in my head. I feel like the buffs that you get from your demon aspects are going to be OP as hell. Um, while you're shifting. And then the legend uh, idea is mostly just if uh, class dips, like actually allow us to double up our wisdom bonus, then we might just dip a bunch of classes and that's where legend would come in. I don't know, I've not been too impressed with what I've heard from Gold Dragon. I, I suppose it is supposed to be the best just getting like absurd stats, but it doesn't seem like it does much else from what I've heard. Move out. Of course, maybe you don't need to do a lot else if you can do that. All right, let's see Wolverine Into at work here. Really, they really do make it look like Wolverine, huh? Those are not claws coming out of her fingers. Like, those claws are not coming from here. Those claws are freaking like, yeah. You're right, definitely Wolverine-like claws. 
Damn, are claw attacks like that on every character? I, I don't I don't use natural attack builds that much. Head on. There's not anything over here. Why am I searching? Again, I've gotten so used to searching everything in Pillars of Eternity, I gotta get used to not searching it again. All right, let's go, peeps. Well, I could go anything, but I don't know. Gold Dragon and Swarm, neither one Onwards. grabs my interest for this character. any charge what the hell did I forget how to play this game I mean whenever I click these things spells should come up and abilities and am I wrong maybe I'm wrong thought that was how this game works though Is this one of the bugs you were talking about, you Igor? Trust me. Like what the hell? I will help where Open I can. Your heart to me. No reason All to this waiting bores me. Because that's Meditate annoying the hell out of me. It might make you feel better. Now that I know about it. Mmm, the mods are breaking. I checked all the mods and they all showed that they were good to go, but maybe not. All right, we got to fix that. So let's save right here right quick. And let's exit and we're going to fix that mod issue. We'll be back in one minute. I'm not going to actually going anywhere. We're just going to fix this uh, mod issue right quick. We're not actually using any of the mods for anything like super important. At least not this early. Some of them are absolutely essential, like bubble buffs, but um, let's just uninstall them so that we don't have to worry about anything. Okay, now, opening the game back up. Let's go, let's go. All right, and uh, again, I want to ask everybody if you've not already done so, hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe. If you're over on Twitch, like uh, Jared and Igor, give us a follow. Those things help us out immensely. All right, um, a lot of you are interested in this today, which is freaking sweet as hell. I don't think we've ever had... 35 uh, members on stream before and we've gotten close to that a couple times tonight so hit those like and subscribe buttons help us get up to 35 or maybe even 40 a new first for us uh, I just stopped like everything oh crap really toy box is like the one that I missed what the hell Oh, there. Hopefully that'll work. Let's continue. Yeah, and cheating is fun, Jared. We're all about the cheats. All cheating all the time, baby. Rely on me. Ah, there we go. All right. What's on your mind? Yeah. Wonder. The problem is fixed. No reason to pause. Well, 
Together we stand. I am helpful, am I not? No, Jared, I'll have none of that, all right? You're always talking about how you want us to play on unfair. You want us to play on unfair because you want to laugh at us whenever we die. And then uh, whenever we finally played on Unfair, where were you at? Huh? You weren't here? I found something. So, no, no. We'll, we'll be having no more of the Unfair I playing. I appreciate this. We are the light. They are the darkness. Sorry, I just realized something is not right over here. Just gonna fix that real quick. There. That that just seems more right. Sorry. All right, let's go with that. Die! No. God damn it. No. Always happens here whenever you're fighting this damn thing. One person blocks everybody else off, and then everybody else dies from attacks of opportunity because the AI is too damn stupid to uh, to not run around and give the cultists with the freaking uh, pole arm, you know, extra attacks. Sorry, that crap annoys me. We've actually had playthroughs ended on Last of Lanty mode because of that. And it's just like, what the hell? Continuing onward. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's just turn-based mode, while I do prefer it uh, in most ways to real-time with pause, it does take far, far, far longer. And, you know, time is kind of a concern whenever we're streaming. Um, also, keeping things interesting is kind of a concern. And... I found battles taking uh, three times as long as they something. otherwise no could the is frame. not generally entertaining for most people. But yeah, whenever it's just me, no stream, definitely prefer the turn mode as well. Where they changed that? That did not used to be like that. Anyways. Mm, yeah. We're going to go with that.
I don't think the cultists look different, Yomagami. I don't know. Anybody think the cultists look different? Oh, you little... I think they're acting different. Being little Pitkas. Oh, crap. Okay. All right. How about you go back to your claws? Run them through. There we go. Hey, look. We're actually getting some hits in. Imagine that. people are should have just turned that on earlier all right is that right is that right No, the only one shirtless around here is land, Yomogami. Just the land. Although these do look different, don't they? I don't know. Maybe they did upgrade some of this stuff. Open your heart to me. Maybe. Maybe it's all in my head. All in my head, I Save think about it over and life. over again. Take you. Yeah, I, I, I gotta say, I don't know how much attention you are paying, but especially for, for just natural claw attack, like. I feel like we're doing a lot of damage. Every time our player character gets a hit in, it's like 7, 8, 10, 11, 13. Um, definitely is, is higher than I think anybody else is getting here. And we didn't even max our strength either. We could have we could have gone with 20. We only went with 18. That's what shamans are good for. They're good for buffing and protecting. Now what is that? And even if they are great at damage or whatever else, they're not as good at that as they are at buffing and protecting, so that's all we need. If I go if I try to put her up into melee, she's she's gonna end up dying, just like the last fight. Um so yeah. A bright and that's what Cammy's gonna be doing. She keeps us alive until we're strong enough that we don't need her anymore. No one stands in my way. And that's pretty much it. They will break against our resolve. See that bite for eight? That's all e Igor's doing right there.
All right, let's bust out our wand here. Get a little bit of healing going on. Guess we can waste one on you as well. Probably good enough. Probably. Oh wow, we never did anything with I don't know. What's a good what's a good mammoth name? Give me a good mammoth name. No, you ain't getting no weapon finesse. Are you crazy? Um We'll go ahead and give you some dodge, I guess. No, not even dodge. Iron will. Iron will. Oh no, it's Malicus! Wants us to name him Charles? Why Charles? Where did you get Charles? That was funny. And necessary school thing wants Manny. Manny's what I was going to say, but that's kind of too obvious for a mammoth. How about... There. Combination of all y'all's ideas. Charles Manimuth. No, oh, no. Well, it's definitely not Charles Manson. We're, we're not mansoning things on here. Maybe if it was our player character's mammoth, because our player character's kind of like that, but uh, don't think Lan is. Don't think Lan is. All right, so far so good, people. Let's grab whatever we can find in here. What's that there? Be nice if they had like a speed up button for whenever you're just like running around randomly. That'd be pretty sweet. What's on your mind? I wonder. All right, everybody, go get them. The inheritor. As you can see, Charles Mannymuth is not too smart. Actually, I just took uh, Lan for the shield maze part of it. I was planning on kicking him to the curb and taking Wendy once uh, once we get to... Um, uh, damn, I can't remember her name. You know, the crazy the, 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 the crazy one at the end of the shield maze. Uh, Hosilla. Hosilla. That's her name. Took me a minute. Move out. I heed the voice of the spirits. Into the fray. Get another obstacle. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, how do you not have any frickin' potions? What the hell? That is not cool. I'm all right. Drink the potion. Drink the potion. Thank you. Lay on hands. Lay on hands. And you 
Why didn't we do this already? Ah. Let's go with the white dragon aspect. There we go. Dude, whenever we turn that aspect on, and just me or that damage will start cranking. Does it really change that much? Maybe it's all in my head. Yeah, I guess it's all in my head because I don't see anything about damage here. So. Well, it does change the type of damage you do, I guess. But still, not like the amount of damage you're doing. Alright, let's throw that on her. Yeah, I guess there's not really anything else we need, huh? We're good. I lead, you follow. That's right. I'm the leader. You're the not leader. Let's go. All right, so through here, we'll find the first hand of Hosilla. Shouldn't be too hard unless she they get a crit on us right here. If that hand gets a crit on us, then that could be bad. But as long as there's no crits, we should be good. Good. Not wiping. Hopefully. Yeah, yeah. So you played through all this with the Manticore already, and the Manticore was pretty OP through it. But I gotta say, it definitely seems like our damage is just really, really good. Uh, especially for level one. That's all I gotta say about it. Um, so I guess we can go in I'm here, and who wants to play Ring Around the Rosie? No reason to pause. That's basically what we gotta do here. I know Jared's going to complain about it, but I think the rest of you uh, probably understand and are fine with it. Most likely. Mm. Actually, let's trade that out. Camellia should be able to hit far better than our player character with this thing. So let's do that. Well, let's move already. What do we have here? Really, the phase shifter? I looked at the phase shifter and I wasn't too impressed. Maybe I should have looked more closely. 
Manticore getting 260 foot ranged attacks at level one though does seem pretty OP. Especially if they're doing as much attacks as our claw attacks are doing. Meditate on your you mistakes. Me. Might make you feel better. Let me draw the first blood. Many goes down here, then it's gonna suck. So come on, Manny. You can do it. All right, just in case anybody's wondering, we're going to be streaming this pretty much every day this week, every afternoon, um, and probably every day or almost every day until we actually complete the entire playthrough. And this will be the first playthrough that we do that also includes the uh, Treasure of the Midnight Isles DLC. And of course, um, the last Sarkorian's DLC. Haven't done that one before. And Inevitable Excess. Like, we're going to knock all three of those out with this character in this playthrough. Uh, first time we've done that. And so we should have a really good, thorough idea. Because that's definitely going to be like 100 plus hours, I'm sure. Um, should have a really, really good idea of just how good the shifter is. After 100 plus hours of streaming this playthrough and going through all the DLCs with it. So, i just letting y'all know that. So if you haven't already, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, turn on your notification bells so you don't miss it whenever we go live. And uh, yeah. Uh, I know right now most of you are probably thinking, why the hell would I want to watch you fight a water elemental for 15 minutes? Like how? How are you going to get a like for that? And all I can say is that this is the only time in the playthrough that we'll uh, resort to this much cheese. That, that's the only defense I have of it. Hopefully that's good enough for you. If it's not, well, then sorry. That would probably help. Just realized I had that on. Don't guess there's much else I can do that'll help, though. I wonder if... Mm. Out of my way! Die! I don't know. It should be week two. No! He's gonna die. Damn it. All right. This just got ugly. This just got ugly. Yep. Ugh. You've crossed the wrong monster. Faster, faster. What are you doing? Oh my god, Lan, how the hell are you so slow?
How are you all so slow? Oh, oh my Bob. Okay, he's focused in on her. So if we can just get you two up to here, maybe. Where the hell are you at, Lan? Get up here. Oh my god. Come on people, I need y'all hitting harder than that now. Endure this. Almost works better than Manny, actually. Oh, that's going to take a long time, but it almost works better because she can't outrun the water elemental like Manny can. Charles Manny Mutt, rather, I should say. Also, I'm sorry I'm not looking at the chat right now. I'm just trying to not screw this up and wipe. You know, we've got a death counter for a reason. We want that thing to read zero whenever we finish the Inevitable Excess DLC, you know, two or three weeks from now. down to half she were a little bit faster she could actually shoot at the damn thing but she's not uh, she ain't fast enough for that let's go ahead and throw his buffs on because this is taking way too long All right, you can start shooting again now, Lan. There you go. Yeah, and the mirror is that elemental gating on it. Like, ever so slowly. But I think it is. I don't know. Probably all in my head, maybe. Maybe. Stay away from me. I'd rather stay away from Camellia. Oh, come on. The shitty part about playing on hard or unfair difficulty. But you get to something like this and it takes an absurd amount of time just to freaking get a hit on it. Damn it, she died. And you're focused in on land now, huh? Can land get over here in time? I don't know, maybe. Ah, uh, land should be faster than it. Faster than Camellia. No. Unexpected. Well, shit, I think we wiped people. That sucks. And in the one fight, you're not supposed to be able to wipe in, too. You know what? Let's give it our best, then. Are you serious? 
We lost because Lan is dead? That's bullshit. That is horse shit. We lost because Lan died. What the hell is that? That was ridiculous. I am helpful, am I not? <laughs> uh, I don't think it's so much that I'm rusty, it's just I was trying to do something cool with our new dragon powers and shapeshifter dragon shifting powers. Pay attention. And so Manny died and once that happened it was uh not good, not good. I hope you appreciate this. I heed the voice of the spirits. In the future, I should probably just stick to the plan, even if it does take long. We're probably just gonna skip the water elemental because I'm not gonna put y'all through that fight twice. Continuing onward. Can't hide from me. I'll cut you wide open. None shall escape. There was a way to tell him to just like not move. on dying, Matt, especially not in the one battle that it's impossible to die in, unless, of course, you stop paying attention. Damn, we were doing really well, too. We are kicking everybody's ass. That's unfortunate. Move out. Now what is that? Got it. Head on. I found uh something. That took way too many uses, but you know, whatever. Oh damn, and he's gone. Charles Menemuth is gone completely. What's that there? You follow. Do not be. Do not waver. Thank <laughs> you. 
I guess it's good to know that this is considered Land's Quest, so... We, um... Gotta protect Lan, apparently. Something I was not aware of. I am helpful, am I not? <laughs> the spirits demand they your blood. Will break against our resolve. Let's hear you cry. <laughs> I'll just sit here. Oh, great. Don't worry about me. Let's see. Let's throw that on her. Run them through. Out of Go get them. That one's down. Die. All right, that's fine. We can get this. No. Run them There's that uh, wisdom bonus. Die. Saving our butts. Wisdom to AC, baby. <laughs> Did you see that? Damn, that was a hell of a bloody explosion. Alright, how about we um Actually heal you this time and we'll probably do better for that in the next fight. I am helpful, am I not? Hey Jim so it's uh it's going pretty well, going pretty well except for we died to the water elemental. Uh-huh. Which is garbage. But we did it. We died to him. My fault, not paying attention. Um, you can trust me. So far, granted, we're only level two and we're only in the shield maze, but the shifter class seems uh, well, pretty damn strong so far. No without risk. I mean, look at that. Our bite's doing 10 damage. What the hell is that? Move out. Oh, uh, Internet Andy, smite doesn't work against elementals. I just saw that you suggested that. Uh, it only works against evil characters, and elementals are always neutral. What do we have here? Unless they're like a corrupted elemental or something. Um, but yeah, that one's not. Head on. Uh, we're almost back to where we were. Not too bad, I guess. Certainly had much worse. 
Glad we didn't decide to go last as Lanti. That would have been terrible. Do not waver. Certainly wouldn't be the first time it's ever happened to us, though. Nice, nice. That one well. Right here, we're going to go ahead and uh, use that smite this time. We kicked their asses in the last fight, but I do not trust us to do that well two fights in a row against the corrupted mongrel brute. Cut down to pieces! And that's why. One-shotting us. And that's what the hell they do. That's what they do. Damn it. Crap, I forgot which spell I cast. Which spell did it hurricane book? Okay. This is not the end. Son of a bitch. Damn it. We're in trouble. We're more than trouble. We're pretty much dead. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. up again we've done the first dungeon so many times andy it's i don't know this is the first well this is the first time we've done this well i guess second time we've done this in about eight nine months but this is the first time that we've wiped multiple times in the freaking dungeon in a long time so Eh, maybe the shifter's not very good, but more likely, I just suck. That's probably the more likely uh, explanation. Hmm. And if you've been noticing, I've been forgetting to heal between battles, this. been forgetting to save, and um, been forgetting to buff, too. So yeah, something. yeah, I'm gonna go with I just kind of suck right now. By the time we get through here, I, hopefully I'll be back into the swing of things. Can't hide from me. I'll cut you wide open. Ah! 
What's that there? The Inheritor! Guide my blade! of my time. What's that there? Save the last one for me. Oh, poor Jim. I am sorry, Jim. Jim is listening to us play while stuck in traffic. Dude, that's terrible. I'm sorry that uh, you're having to resort to listening to us. It must be a terrible, terrible day for you. You know, let's an interesting idea, Jim. I've never tried to skip so much of the shield maze that I was still level 2 whenever I reached the tavern. Has anybody else tried that? That's an interesting strategy. I've never even considered that it might be possible, but I always do the elementals and get radiance and all of that. I lead, am I, not? I don't know. What do y'all think? Should we skip as much of the shield maze as possible so that we can get cheaper mercenaries? Let me know. We are the light. They are the darkness. Oh, oh no, it's Malicus says that you kill everything you possibly can everywhere. I mean, that's do not generally what I do, although I do skip some side stuff that I just feel like isn't important or is annoying. Um, but yeah, for the most part, kind of what I do too, usually. But it is an interesting idea to uh, get level 2 mercenary, or to get cheaper mercenaries. Um, I do usually like to use mercenaries. We'll have to see. I'm not sure if it's actually worth not hitting level 6 before we fight Monago, though. 
And I don't know, maybe you two, maybe we could still hit level six before we hit Monago, possibly. But usually we hit level six just before getting to her and we've done absolutely everything. So I'm not sure. It seems that everybody is uh, kind of like, yeah, we do everything. We try everything. We everything, everything. Yeah. Of course, you do realize that that means you have to watch me chase the water elemental or rather the water elemental chase me around for 30 more minutes again. So you sure you don't want to reconsider your answer there. Go get this thing. Get another obstacle. Into the fray. Uh, he won't survive me. Wow, dude, look at that. That is crazy. Anyways. An arrow did that. A freaking arrow did that. Oh, here I am, not paying attention again. I just wanted to check real quick and see if we were getting any kind of bonus on damage. Um, and no, uh, it's definitely not helping out our damage. So, Dragon Aspect a little lackluster so far. Well, I mean, the, the the water elemental is incredibly, like, I mean, we've fought the thing 60 times on stream, probably. Definitely at least 45. And that's maybe the fourth or fifth time we've, we've died to it. You know? Like, all you got to do is just stay ahead of it, and it can't win. But I just... Stop paying attention and didn't stay ahead of it. And so it won. Head on. Yeah. I am helpful, am I not? Over there. Yeah. I mean, still, it's not like I want to buy six mercenaries or five mercenaries right away. I don't know. I think I'd still rather have the extra experience just to make sure we hit level six. Um, level six makes, uh, battling Monago and her minions a lot easier. Um, so yeah. I lead, you follow. But the next time, uh, if we try like an all mercenary playthrough again, we will, uh, try employing your, your tactic there, Jim. So that we can all have ones. all mercenaries like, uh, as soon as possible. I will help where I can. 
I actually didn't realize it was possible. Oh, we never did Manny. Yeah, I forgot to remind me to do Manny. Charles Manny Ma. Charles Manny Ma. There we go. And a point there, point here. I like it. Let's go. The light None shall escape take you. Just me or has this game gotten more bloody and more gory? Maybe it's because I've been away from the game for so long, but I definitely don't remember. Like, I don't know. Maybe I do remember it being that graphic. It's probably just been too long. Anyways, uh, where are we at here? Weapons. We should uh, definitely make coming this way a a, a thing from now on anytime we play because getting those heavy crossbows before the water elemental just helps anyways it's definitely more damage than we're getting from anything else so that's pretty nice now what is that you can trust me Oh, we can still, we should still be able to afford two mercenaries right away. And so two mercenaries get you a full party, Jim. Um, actually, one mercenary gets you a full party because of Wooljif. You know, we got one, two, three, four. Wooljif makes five. Manim Charles Manamuth makes six. And then the one mercenary that we purchased for 4,000 gold, I think is what they cost at level three, we'll make number seven. We'll have a seven man person, uh, creature, animal, being, a seven being party. I'll get it right in a minute. What's on your mind? I wonder. We will win this war. I hope you appreciate this. Uh, mercenaries were almost definitely, certainly getting a scald. Like, there's almost no way around that. Scalds are too good. Um, so probably almost definitely getting a scald. And then, I don't know. I'm not sure what the other one might be. I don't much like Social or Darren, so we might make it a priest or an oracle. Make every strike count. Into the fray. Cut them to pieces. Oh, crap. Here comes the cloud. Focus on the paladin. Focus on the paladin. Focus on the paladin. Oh, nice. Good job, Sela. Interrupted the spell. Phenomenal. Phenomenal. Ah, oh, you know what we forgot to buy? We never forget to buy that. We forgot to buy the iron arrows. That sucks. Yeah, that's, that's annoying. You 
gotta be shitting me. Really, you're gonna run right by, come after us? been forgetting to buff Manny. Which sucks. Definitely shouldn't have been forgetting that. That kind of annoys me. is like super awesome they pretty much I don't know they kind of made the barbarian worthless because they're kind of just like a barbarian that's better anyways yeah scalds are pretty incredible playing at higher difficulties like uh, hard definitely recommend uh, employing one no reason to pause move out yeah a barbarian that shares a ludicrous thought but they thought it and now it is so Well, we're about to rest now. Let's just go ahead and rest. Uh, time for some kumbaya and campfire songs, people. Okay, camouflage. Lanny boy, that's all you. And I guess Nightwatch is going to... you yeah hey, I don't care too much about corrupted rituals actually I do I do let's put you on that and see like can go there all right ready break you know I hope this war at least teaches you how to s'mores would be pretty awesome I would definitely arms. enjoy me some s'mores I think we've got hey unsung here. what is up you what is up my your... friend I'm not how are you doing? How is your uh, Oread effigy? Igor tried to get me to steal your idea and make an Oread effigy, but I wouldn't do it. I was like, nope. Unsung's cornered the market Head on that. On. I won't let you tempt me. Though tempt me, he did try. lead you follow I am helpful am I not I think not all right now there we go now you've got some decent AC see see how long it's been I freaking didn't even remember to use my potion of mage armor I want people y'all gotta correct me when I screw this stuff up I'm counting on you I'm counting on you Anyways. A bright future awaits us. I 
don't believe they nerfed barbarians. Thank you, Yomogami. But no, as far as I'm aware, they've not nerfed barbarians. Um, it's just whenever you can give rage powers to the entire party, instead of just hoarding them all for yourself, you're going to be better than the guy who hoards all the rage powers for himself. Onwards. All right, onwards and inwards, people. I'm going to ask again, anybody who has not done so, please like the video. All right, that's a thumbs up. That's the like. Subscribe to the channel. If you're not yet subscribed, we're going to be, uh, like I said before, we're going to be streaming this pretty much well. every day until we finish uh, this playthrough. And that does include the Treasure of the Midnight Isles, Inevitable Excess, and the Last Sarkorians DLCs. All right. They are the so you won't want to miss that. Make sure you're subbed. Make sure you got your notification bells turned on. If you're over on Twitch, give us a follow, please. Um, don't forget this Friday night is Pathfinder Second Edition. Uh, second Edition campaign. Me, Unsung Sam, uh, Sonic Aries. And the last name slips my mind, so I apologize for that. Uh, anyways, yeah, we're all going to be having Go some Pathfinder 2nd Edition fun this I'm Friday right. night, so make sure that I'm you right. are uh, available to get, check that out because it was a hell of a lot of fun uh, last time, and I'm sure it's going to be even better this time. Also, we do have uh, links down in the description below this video, regardless of what platform you're on. What do we have here? Uh, to join us on Discord. Use the link, join us on Discord. We'd love to have you. I am helpful. Am a I goat, not? a lizard, and a human enter a tavern. What it's Lan. It Lan. The bartender asks. <laughs> He's too funny. Rely on me. Uh, if you're talking about the second edition campaign, Yomogami, yeah. Yeah. First one was a lot of fun. Next one's going to be better. Gotta love that, right? Or maybe I don't have to, but I do. I certainly do. It'd be really, really nice, like, two days from now, whenever the, um... The... Mods are all updated for the, uh... The DLC and the patch. Move out! Really hope that they at least get bubble buffs updated before we get out of Act One. Otherwise, well, I'm sure you all know how annoying that gets. Together, we stand. Did we find trouble? No, oh, they did. All right, so last time this guy one-hit crit Sela. Let's see if we can keep him from doing it again. All right, not a one-hit crit, or one crit hit. Whatever, you know what I mean. Still pretty strong, though. Sweet, he's down. All right. Ranger ain't no thing. Uh, 
Oh, also, everybody, I finally finished that Dark Envoy video that I've been working on. Finally got all the editing done. So anybody who is interested in checking out Dark Envoy or interested in my th Head thoughts on. on Dark Envoy, um, you know, this, uh, this Friday, it'll be coming out. Anybody who's a Patreon member can go check it out on Patreon right now. Um, but yeah, be expecting that this Friday. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you'll enjoy it. All right, Hosey Silla, we're coming for you. Our hand of Hosey Silla. See, you get this. Hmm. Not really anything else, I guess. Let's give this to Sila. Definitely looks way freaking cooler than her green wood. All right, let's go. I will help where I can. Oh, heartbeat quickens. I'll cut you wide open. Adios. Yeah. Who got that 23 crit? Who got that 23 crit? It was Sila. Alright, good job, Sila. Good job. I was hoping it was our shifter. It was not. Pay attention. What we should do, we should come in here and drop a bunch of this crap because it's just weighing us down. Good enough, good enough. All right, all right. I said I wasn't gonna do the water elemental again, but I think I lied, people. Do you believe I lied? Should have done this before, just in case. We, um have a slip up now everybody's faster than the water elemental not just manny doubt is the heart's Open greatest heart challenge we will win this war i'm losing my temper Come on, come on, bring it. Over there. Whoa, stop trying to trick me. Ah, no, other way, other way. I guess that's supposed to be a big pot of stew. But is it just me or does that look like a big bag of like gold with some gems and stuff in it? It's probably supposed to be stew though, but definitely looks like, I don't know, a bag of Scrooge McDuck's gold with some gems stuffed in it to me. Whoa, why are you missing everything? Oh, 
what I'm talking about. Seven. Hit him for seven. Seven's pretty big. Now, uh, I just realized you had the Manticore here. How was the, um, the ranged attacking from the Manticore, Matt, against the Water Elemental? Did it seem any better than bows, or were you just still not strong enough to really do much, even with your Manticore natural attacks? I can't, well, we don't have prayer yet, but I can't do bless for this fight. Like, we need the blesses for other fights. Like, we're going to do bless for the fight after this one. And honestly, I don't even think adding a plus one bonus would, like, everybody would still have to roll 20 to hit, I'm sure. Maybe, like, Camellia or Land, maybe. Might be able to roll 18 or 19, maybe. Probably not. Yeah, one for Hosilla and one for um, the next fight. Because the next fight can actually be harder than Hosilla sometimes. All those damn closets do kind of make uh, Hosilla harder, I guess. Even if she herself isn't that hard. Most of the time. Nope, nope, nope. God, people. Just curious. He's only got an AC of 22 right now. What the hell? Hit him. By the way, it's definitely lower than I thought it was going to be. I guess bless or prayer might have helped more than I thought. Although by now, both of them would have worn off. Like, pretty sure prayer is per round, right? So it's only like two rounds. And then bless is one minute, so... Nope, 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 not here. There we go, we finally got another hit. Hey, he's more than halfway down. He's more than halfway down. Ah, 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 ah. Here I am, here I am. Nope, going the other way. Come on, come on. do that though. 
Should have thought of that sooner. Back the other way. Hey, it's, it's down to about a quarter health, or close to it. Probably more, more like a third, but close to a quarter. I guess. Oh, well, that's nice. Camellia's been back there doing jack shit the whole time. That's nice. The spirits demand your blood. Well, looks like we're going back upstairs. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. You won't survive me. Come on, keep chasing. Endure this. Probably would have been dead already if Camellia had, um, Make every strike count. been in the battle the whole time. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. You won't survive me. No, y'all just get your asses back over there. Strike count. You've crossed the wrong mark. You won't survive me. Come on now, don't be getting all crazy, land. Count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. You won't survive me. Endure this. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. You won't survive me. Uh, the shifter is going Endure pretty well this. for the most part. I feel like it's definitely got really good damage. Make every strike count. And pretty good um, 
survivability so far. You've crossed the Unfortunately, you can see we have wiped twice. Um, but uh, I would call both of those my fault and not the fault of these shifters. You won't survive me. Endure this. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mark. So close, so close. You won't this thing shall me. not defeat us again. Endure it won't. This. It's just not gonna Make happen. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. At least I hope not. You won't survive me. Endure this. So close, so close. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. You won't survive me. Gotta say the uh, dragon blood shifter, their their little dragon form ability that they start off with is not Endure the best. This. Just gives you some resistance and Make some healing, and count. doesn't really help with damage or anything at all. So You've crossed the wrong a little bit mongrel. unfortunate. You won't survive me. Endure this. But I guess it's hard to expect Make the level one count. ability to be, you know, You've crossed the very strong. Mongrel. You won't survive me. Come on, just one more hit. One more damage. That's it. He's got one hit point left. Endure this. Maybe two. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. You won't survive me. Endure this. Oh my god, come on. Somebody hit him without it being redu reduced to zero, please. Make every strike count. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. Guess he had more than two hit points left. That's unfortunate. You won't survive me. Endure this. Make every strike ah, we got him! Yes! Camellia came through with five damage. Buy her a beer. She deserves it. Da, 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 da. That's your girl? Yep, that's our girl. Our girl. She's a good one. She's a good one. Taking some getting used to the controls again after playing so much Pillars here lately, Unsung, but starting to get back into the hang of it. If, uh, if you watch like the first 30, 45 minutes of the stream, though, uh, like we were when we were still just in the caves, <coughs> you can tell that I was like uh, not navigating the map very well at all. Um, anyways. <laughs> Excuse me, pretty sure I'm gonna die with this cough. Whether it be tomorrow or 50 years from now, it's never going away. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> ring. We got potions, those are nice. Ashu! No, yeah, no, it'll never die. We're just running from it down here. Yes, it's dead. We defeated it. All right, just because you have enough time to take a nap while we play Ring Around the Rosie with that thing doesn't mean that you should, Ashley. But yeah, in this case, you probably should have.
You mean the game that he is DMing? I don't think that that's going to happen. Then again, what the hell do I know? Uh, Camellia I'm not is a plant, right? Master. Something like water hemlock? And Lawn is some specimen of underground fauna? Like a horned toad? Damn. Is his name Lon, and I've been saying it wrong this entire time? Am I only finding out how to correctly pronounce his name, what, 20 months after the game released? I guess it'd be 18. But 20 months after I started playing the game. I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, a lawn is that thing out in my front yard that's all green. I'm calling him Land, and that's that. Okay, let's uh, let's a get ready for this though. Awaits us. You can trust me. Mm. I actually lied, by the way. I live in South Texas, so my lawn is actually the brown dead thing that's out in the front yard. Not the bright green thing. Sorry, I was feeling bad for lying, so I had to come clean. Uh, probably don't need any of that or that. your back where are you at where are you at there you at what's on your mind so this down here Charles Menemoth you and Sela shall hold the door I heed the voice of the spirits Weapons back. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. He went down quick. Bless go.
Well, damn, we're about to wipe again because of that. This is not the end. Well, I kind of wish I'd have listened to you, Jim. At least we wouldn't have three freaking deaths, which is ridiculous. Um. Let's do this again, but this time Doubt let's do it right. No challenge. misclicks. You can trust me. All this waiting for. I will help where I can. A bright future awaits us. Open your heart to me. Okay. Use that, you use this, Sila. There we go, we got the bless up. be ready for the worst I'm losing my temper you've crossed the wrong mongrel Thank you for dying. Damn. That took way too long. Let's hear you cry. This will leave a bruise. we go we got it the inheritor guide my blade we are the winners they are the not winners move out move already 
Yeah, Jim. Um, well, if you watch the stream right up until we first died to the water elemental, we absolutely wrecked everything. This. Then after had that mental lapse and we died to the water elemental, everything's been going wrong since then. I am helpful. Am I um, not? I think it's mostly just, uh, I don't know, it having been so long since I played. Head on! Uh. And while the shifter might be OP, uh, the jury's still out on that. I would say it's definitely not as OP as the kineticist. As a human kineticist is in the shield maze, at, in the shield maze at least. Because the last time we did this uh, was with the kineticist in the shield maze, and we made it through it. I think we only wiped one time, but the freaking kineticist is just ridiculous. And the shield maze is a human because you already have point blank shot, I, and you're attacking touch AC. Onwards. Very not fair. And whenever we played our unfair playthrough, I mean, we had just spent 14 months playing this game several times a week, many times every day of the week. So, yeah, we were a lot more into the swing of things then. up all that junk and now we can't move so let's drop that drop that drop 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 i think we did find s oh wow that's amazing you know what we just did we just fought that last group without our armor on that's why we lost to them because we never put our armor back on after we finished the the water elemental so, yeah, see, like I said, keep making stupid boneheaded mistakes like that. That's why we're wiping, not necessarily because it's more difficult. Just because we're less practiced. Now we got to find our armors. Actually, no, no armor for you, I guess. Yep, that Baphomet shell shield definitely fits you better, Sela. So keep, keep that, keep that. I did have a strategy. Don't wear armor when fighting the the water elemental. That was the strategy. Unfortunately, that strategy did not work so well against the um, the corrupted Mongols. I'm actually pretty surprised we beat them the second time. But it's no wonder we had to use so many potions. Told me to push H to hold, and I keep hitting H now, and we're losing party members because of it. Yeah. 
There we go. I am helpful, am I not? All right. Who's ready to go and face Hosilla? It's not shears. My wounds pile on. Stop piling on the wounds, damn it. Uh, okay, good enough, good enough. Good affliction. Nice, it worked. Alright, Hosilla, we're coming for you. Well. Yeah, we're gonna give that to you. You get to have this. I don't really care too much about Shield of Faith. You can use our other bark skin potion though. Should uh where's it at? Some endurance yeah, bears endurance, use that. Mm. I don't know. I think I feel pretty pretty good about that setup. I think. Yeah, let's do it. You see, because we took land, we can uh, choose the Demon Mythic Path option here now, Matt. Succumb to the Rage. Kick the Bomblex ass with our newfound power. And when Wendy shows up, she'll help us fight Hosilla, making it a five on one battle instead of a four on two. Or actually, I guess with our pet, a six on one battle instead of a five on two. They will break against our resolve. Oh, damn. We should have healed, though. How did I miss healing? That's a bit unfortunate. Into the fray! No, you are not all right. Damn, did you kill Sila? I couldn't tell. Hopefully not. Uh. We are the light. They are the darkness. Nope, Sila made it. Sila made it. All right, good. That that makes things a little simpler then. Without risk. I... You won't 
survive me. Taking them damn things down quick. Way quicker than normal. Very nice. Fuck yeah. That was about as well as that battle can go. I made my decision. Oh no. We forgot to take all. Well, we couldn't really take his gear off. He didn't really have anything good, anyways. Yeah, that's fine. Goodbye, Lan. Come with me, Windwog. You're making a mistake. If some priest ever winds up down here, I'll ask him to pray for your soul, but I doubt it'll help. Len knows too much. He must die. Yes, you must die, Lan. You suck, Wendy. You missed. Just saying. Maybe you still harbor feelings for this Lan character since he was secretly your lover. Or maybe not so secretly. Not clear on that part. Now we can level you. Um, you know, we might make Windwogger tank this time. It's been a while since I've had her be a tank. Um, but the few times that we tried it, she did really well at it. And Sila's not really that good at tanking. She's really not. So, we're going to do that. Hmm. Trying to think, like tank, no tank. No, I don't think we're gonna do it. I don't think we're gonna do it. Not not on hard difficulty. If it was core, I'd do it. But on hard, I just, I got a feeling it's not gonna work as well. Um, so yeah. I guess we can go ahead and make her a hunter. Since that's what we did with Lan, or what we were doing with Lan. Wandering marksman. I kinda wanna make her a ranger instead. Yeah, maybe we'll make her a ranger instead. Let's give her some levels in Freebooter, right? Yeah, let's try that. We're going to give her some levels in Freebooter. Although... Oh, she's already got precise shot, so I guess that doesn't matter. Yeah, we're going to do that. We'll see how it goes. Oh, yeah? Well, I, I have gone with Wendy, like, uh, with a, um, a full fighter archer build, and it did work out pretty well. I've not had any full ranger archer builds, so I don't know. I will say that Arushale is a freaking beast, though, but 
it's hard to gauge with her because she gets so many more like stats like such she has such higher stats is what i should say than all the other characters so it's kind of kind of hard to judge just how much of it is her and how much of it's the class also whenever i play her i like to dip her into fighter whenever i'm using her or either fighter or slayer but usually fighter um it's pretty nice all right here we go damn we don't really have anybody to use that sucks you know what we're gonna give you this glaive anyways it's not your claws no but one stands in my way what? did we not just equip you with that Oh, you're not proficient with that. Yeah. That's annoying. Oh, maybe we'll just give that to you then, Wendy. Especially since you don't have a bow anyways. I am yours to command. There you go. Where do you want me? That'll work for now. Where's Dara? There she is. Yeah, Aru's pretty overpowered. I mean, if you look at her stats, I forget. I don't know how many points it takes to give her her stats, but it's way freaking more than what, what we start out with. That's for damn sure. I don't know. I'm sure if you Googled it, that you could probably find the answer pretty quick. I just know it's way more points than what a character starts out with. Good enough. Yeah. Oh, you know what we could have bought though? A little late for it, but let's just go ahead and buy that ammo anyways. So that we have it. Let's go pick up our radiance. Ah, uh, well. I played Pillars 1 a little bit more last night. Um, got the Twin Elms. Move out. I mean, it's going pretty well. I'm not too sure what to do about that. I'm not sure if I want to just play it and finish it by myself off stream. Or if I want to try to finish Pillars 1 alongside the new Wrath of the Righteous playthrough. You know, like maybe play Pillars 1 in the mornings and Wrath of the Righteous in the afternoons or evenings until they're both done and then just concentrate only on um, the last Sarkorian's Wrath of the Righteous playthrough that we're on right now. Um, I don't know. What are y'all's thoughts? What would y'all like to see? Let me know. Together we stand. your back yeah. I'll prove I'm the best Battles you're gonna watch wait. my back you better do it from way back cut them to pieces the inheritor guide my blade Did I mess up again? Oh, 
man, that thing is so overpowered. I love it. So OP. Like a lock during, like a lock playing WoW in 2006, seven, that era. OP as hell. What the hell are you doing? Really, you can't charge? What the hell? Why not? I'll rip you Whatever. Apart. Spell's not working like that. Uh, did I mess up again? Probably just yeah, wasted well, that, but oh well. No thanks to you. I hope you appreciate this. Yeah, I think we're at the point in the playthrough no where I'm kind of just, yeah, heading for the end of the story. The, the main story is really, really interesting anyways. And Dispatch those fools. so, yeah, right, we're, that, that, that's kind of what we're doing. Just headed for that. We did do the Winter March 1. Don't think we're going to do Winter March 2. Good to know, good to know. Yeah. I mean, we did do the first DLC, but uh, I guess I'm kind of agreeing with you because we're not planning on hitting up the second DLC for it. Good. Oh yeah, and Unsung, I looked around for that freaking quest for that armor, could not find it. Um, so we kind of left that armor behind. I don't know if you caught that on the last stream or not. But yeah, we did leave that behind. A little bit saddening, but yeah, I guess a not that big of a deal. I heard the voice of the Rely on me.
Oh, we tried. You can trust me. Only you deserve my obedience. Die! Do not fear! Do not waver! Boom, down. That's what I'm talking about. I'll just sit here. Really? What the ball? Don't like you. Trying to remember which one of these is Earth. I think blue and wider. And they're pretty sure those are ice. Then we have fire. Then we have corrosion. Get him, got him, good him. They're dead. Open your heart to me. Hmm. Yeah, I went to dwarves in front of the temple, and there was one there who gave me a quest to go find ore. Um, and I ended up finding gems, and I did that. Um, I don't know, was it the pissed off dwarf who was angry at the people inside the temple? Was it that one? Because I think I kind of called that guy on his bullshit and made him mad at me. So maybe I didn't get the quest because of that, if it was him. Together we stand. <laughs> my temper I'm losing my temper I found oh. something well then I guess I shouldn't have been uh, I guess I should have been nice to him but he was just so whiny and bitchy I couldn't help it I am helpful am I not Oh, the armor's inside the temple? It's not a quest reward? Oh, hell, that's easy. We'll just go in there, we'll slit the priest's throat, and we'll take it out of the freaking chest. That's, that's so much simpler than doing a quest. Thank you, Obsidian, for uh, making it so easy. Well? I crave your commands. I'll watch your back. We will win this war. Let's move already. Where do you want me? None shall escape. No 
glory without risk! Run them through! <laughs> going to be interesting to see just how good the shifter is as the game progresses because so far through two levels I think it's definitely one of the stronger classes I've played definitely one of the stronger melee classes I've played um, but through two levels doesn't mean much Appreciate this. Move out. Didn't we get a new armor in there? Yeah, half plate. Let's go ahead and throw that on Sila. Don't believe there's well, radiant. We can throw that on her. Shouldn't be anything else here that really matters. All right. That's GTFO, peeps. All right. So while we're running back over here to uh, sell and finish up the uh, the first part of the shield maze, or first part of the game, I guess, the last part of the shield maze, I would like to ask all of you, if you've not already done so, please hit the like button, the thumbs up, definitely appreciate that please do it turn on your notification bell so you don't miss it whenever we go live remember we have that dark envoy video scheduled to come out this friday so uh check that out dark envoy looks awesome you can get my thoughts on it and friday night we have pathfinder second edition uh tabletop rpg campaign episode two going on so um that's something you might be interested in come check it out it should be pretty damn fun um, also, below the video, regardless of if you're watching this on Twitch or YouTube, uh, you should be able to find a link to our Discord. Use that link, join us on Discord, we'd love to have you there. So yeah, do those things, people. They help us out. And we appreciate them. Is that it? Really? I feel like there should have been more. Hmm. Onwards. Oh, well. Come on, Dira. Yeah, I think we're a couple hundred gold short of where we normally are, but we did buy an extra.
that. Well, that's not cool. I do appreciate everybody subscribing. I was having audio issues at the beginning of the stream, so I had to change my audio settings, and that may be what is screwing up. Uh, all right, people, give me, give me, give me two minutes here, three minutes. I'll see if I can fix that. Um, be right back. Be right back. Mitchell Becker subscribed to the channel. Thank you, Mitchell Becker. Thank you, everybody. Apparently, the sound settings for our intermission screen here are still correct. So, um, yeah, yeah, apparently they're still correct. That's, that's odd. Um, but yeah, thanks for the, uh, the invite. Let me fix this. I'll be right back. Or, excuse me, the subscription, Mitchell. All right, I don't know if y'all can still hear me or not. I just turned down the audio. Um, hopefully that got rid of the weird feedback. The only issue is I don't think y'all are going to be able to hear the game now, which uh, which sucks. The uh, one day we've been waiting for for months is the first day that we've had any technical issues on stream in forever. And I guess that's just the way things go sometimes, huh? Unfortunately. Hello? All right, that seems to still be working. We still have no game audio, though. All right, you, let me know if the um, feedback is fixed or if you're still having issues with it. I'm going to go ahead and switch back to uh, just playing the sound through my headphones. 
since that seems to be the only way to get game sound in the current state of things. Um, but let me know if that feedback continues, please. Sorry, I'm trying to get y'all game audio back. Okay, y'all should be able to hear the game audio once again. Let me know if y'all are getting any weird feedback or whatever. And I assure you, as soon as this stream's over, that um, we'll get this crap fixed. And it won't be an issue tomorrow. I don't know why it's an issue now, but... Uh, We'll get it fixed. By the goddess. No, I... I couldn't get the sound to work for the game. Everything's I, fine. The Let sound was working fine for everything but the game. The only way I Until could get the, the game to work... Pondor no, is through desktop well, audio. I see that you had a very good that That's it. That's the only way the game sound will play on stream right now. And because I'm on stream, I don't have the time to go through everything I need to go through to troubleshoot it and fix it. So we we are y'all are listening to desktop audio right now. Um, everything else would play audio just fine. Um except for the game. So, anyways, yeah. That's why we got this kind of screwed up setting at the moment. Save the last one for me. The light take you. Here you cry. Oh, the slaughter. Now, I would say that this is probably the door, the locked door, like, in the entire game that I get shut out of most. I bet we get shut out of it as often as we actually get it open or maybe pretty close to it. Now, back into here. This should be fun and interesting. No one stands in my way. Yamagami, I don't think anybody wants to listen to me go bat, pow, slice, poke for the next three, four, five, six hours. There's a reason why uh, old Batman doesn't still play on air for people. They will break against our resolve. Just sit here. 
Don't worry about me. Wow, really? You're already down? What the hell? This is not the way to do it. Yeah, no shit, Wendy. This is not the way to do it. Out of my way! I think we realized that. Um. The hell beg me to stop! I'll rip you apart! Let them through. Thank you. Go for their hearts. Ow. Oh, yay, they just killed Sila. That's sh that'll surely make things simpler. Stinking clouds, man. Well, that's probably why you can't buy uh, Dimension Door Scrolls anymore in Act 1, Pondor. We have you to thank for that. You and your kind. I lead, you follow. Yeah, Sila has a status effect, all right. It's called death. Uh, Mythic Path is going to be Demon. Possibly into legend, possibly sticking with demon. Um, we did have some people pushing for, or one person, pushing for gold dragon, but I don't know. I, I'm, I'm feeling demon with this character. And like I said, possibly legend. You take zero blame, sir, but... Uh, the blame is still yours, nonetheless, even if you take none of it. It's definitely yours. What's this? Do we have guests? <laughs> Just in time. The place is a... <gasps> you Minago, just... the one who... So you've already started a playthrough, a Shifter playthrough, or at least a Last Sarkorian DLC playthrough? Is that what you're saying? Stinking, stinking cloud. Oh my god, I hate you.
is ours. Onwards. Basic shifter, no archetype. Oh, that's cool. Got it. Um, Done. I considered the basic shifter. The after looking at the character cards, I don't know. I wasn't as encouraged as I thought I would be. Especially you, my pet. Or as I, as I was expecting to be. In your blood. So, uh, I decided that the cry. dragon is probably going to be the strongest. Either the dragon or the manticore. And beg me to stop. But the base shifter at least gets to keep the uh, instinct ability that converts wisdom to AC, which is why I was considering going with just the base shifter. That's it. I'm tired of playing around. Did we just kill Minaga? What? I don't remember her disappearing there before. We'll dig out holes where your eyes should be. How invent? <laughs> Powerless rage. Uh... Oh. Okay, she's not gone because she's gone. She's just gone because of a bug, I guess. I don't know. Be quick and... I don't know why she's gone. Oh damn, I didn't even Praise realize it was Iron already 9:30 and you were already Healing finished. Your wounds was easy. We couldn't stay. You hurt the wards. There's another problem. Yes. All right. Hey, I just want to thank everybody who's here watching this, enjoying this with us. This has been by far our most watched and successful stream since the uh, Midnight Isles DLC. So thank you everybody for that. And anybody who's here who has not already done so, please like, subscribe, turn on your notification bells. We're gonna take this thing all the way through all of the DLC and the main game. So you won't wanna miss that. Um, if you're over on Twitch, give us a follow and use the link down below the video to join us on Discord, please. All right, we'd love to have you there. Come talk with us. All right, we're lonely, we need you. All this waiting for us. Uh, let's see here. Hey, where's my money at? Only a thousand. Blech. Blech. I did not know that you brought a raid, sir. Um, thank you for bringing a raid. And thank you for everybody who came along with uh, with Pondor. I guess I must have uh, missed the, that part in the chat. Or could it be that you just didn't tell me? I don't know. I don't know. But thank you for the uh, raid either way, Pondor. All right. Seems that we have you to thank for uh, hitting 30 uh, viewers again. So, awesome. Oh, yeah, we had a mod issue, by the way. Um, kind of, I don't know, after about an hour that where we couldn't right. get these to open and access our, um, well, access the windows behind them. So yeah, we, we took a little break and I restarted the game without any mods. I'd love to say that I'm just so damn smart that I immediately knew that it was mods, but um, the chat told me. They knew. I didn't. So thanks, guys. Um, need brave and experienced fighters. Only 4,500 gold. Sure. Actually, I don't think we have 4,500 gold. 
Do we have 45? Okay, we do. Sweet. All right, time to create a character. And we've already discussed what it's going to be, so no surprises here. Hey, Gregor. Actually, that is a very good point. I guess that makes it, well, no, not the only class. I don't know, maybe I need to look at it again. Maybe, um, I was gonna say it having sneak attacks and full BAB is, uh, I guess that is pretty good. Maybe, maybe the phase shifter warrants another look. Um, anyways, let's see what we can find here. Actually, the default character portraits are not too bad for this, so maybe we'll go with one of them. That one's pretty damn good. Actually, I think we'll wait on the Scald. Let's go ahead and grab a Priest. Let's grab a Priest instead. And then we'll get, we'll make the Scald our second Mercenary. Yeah, in my experience, it's usually C, Pondor. Restart that shit and it magically goes away. That was not the, the issue today. Pretty good priestess, right? No. Yeah, no, I get too picky with these uh, pictures, huh? Um. There should be one with like a crazy lady and a pool of blood, and that's the one I was actually looking for. I have too many uh, photos in here. Definitely too many. Now we're kind of getting back closer to where I thought it was, maybe. Actually, that one's like really good. I think we used that for our kineticist last time though. Actually, I hadn't thought about a dare. Yeah, maybe, maybe we get a dare. We need a tank, right? All right, okay, we're going. We're gonna make a dare. Thank you for reminding me. A dare it is. And then we'll get the priest later. And the scald. Um. Thank you. 
Actually, sorry. I know I'm all over the place. Let's wait on a dare. And maybe I'll just get a photo of a dare and I'll add it to our custom photos. And on the next stream, we can add one with the actual proper face. That sounds better, right? Let's do that. Okay. We're going to go with this one. We're going to go ahead and go with the Scald after all. Um, scald. Ugh. Trying to remember which one we decided was the best. The Herald of the Horn was... Yeah, because you lose basically nothing. Or Battle Singer. I actually think I might want to... I think we're just going to go with the Herald of the Horn. Battle Scion was the other one. Alright, Herald of the Horn it is. Let's, you and you and unsung Pondor, y'all are quick to cry heresy and sacrilege. It's like, Adair's dead. Heresy, sacrilege. You're using mercenaries. Heresy, sacrilege. Like, no, no, it's not, you know. We're in the middle of a war. There's freaking mercenaries everywhere. It's natural. Um, anyways. Yeah, I was going to go Battle Singer first, but Battle Singer lost too many of its, um, too many rage powers. I don't know. I didn't like that. So we're going to go with the one that's just clearly better because you lose one crap ability that does virtually nothing anyways, and you gain a few other abilities in their place. Um, so I don't think we're going to go L, maybe half L. Yeah, we're going to go with uh, Brissy and Explorer background. Where is it at? Nope, not there. Help make up for that low reflex save a little bit. Yep, strength and charisma. I like it, I like it. You don't really need anything else. Actually, it's not true. We're going to give you 13 decks. Yeah, I think that should work. Use magic device. We'll let you persuade because we're probably not going to be using Ember. Mm -hmm.
Yeah, I guess that's good enough. Hey, thanks, Pondor, for dropping in, dropping by. Sorry I did not thank you for the raid soon enough. I'll try to learn better uh, Twitch raid etiquette there. Uh, but thank you again, my friend, for uh, popping by. Hope that the night goes well for you. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Performance, arcane armor training, blind fight. I think we actually need any of that. Definitely don't need any of this. Um, actually, maybe we could go for selective, and we could uh, throw down some greases. That, uh, that might work pretty well. Yeah, we're gonna do that. No, we're not, no, we're not. I lied. We're gonna go here and grab Conjuration. for sure and just not very many good spells here this will take remove fear mm, who is she uh, actually where's it at uh, Calistria Yep, you're gonna worship Calistria. That's fine. Give me some black hair though. I don't care too much about the tattoo for you. Oh, oh, that looks pretty good. I like that with the color. Kind of matches. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. That's that, that looks good for a skull. Actually, maybe we'll make it match. Hmm. I don't know. What do you think? Maybe that's a little too much. I think I like the green better. Yeah, let's go with the green. I don't know, I don't know. We're gonna see whenever we get to Winter's Grasp. I'm actually not even sure what level that is. This will but I'm hurt. definitely interested to see You're what the new spells are. I'll carve my name onto your flesh. We do it my way. Get it off me. The path. I am superior. Does anyone require? Also, what's my up, Pledge Eighty Eight? Damn, son. Winter's grasp is Canadian grease. Pretty, uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Do we have the wrong gender for this? It's kind of hard to tell with elves. Yeah, okay. There, that's better. Huh. And off we go. 
I'm not touching that. I won't annex. Hesitation is a way. Hey, have my. We won't falter. With grace. Working. That's mean. All right, we got our mercenary. That's what matters. Get our levels here going. This ability does almost nothing. Why the hell would I? I'm not picking that. I'm not doing it. No. Levels on our scald here. Yeah, that looks pretty good. We're gonna give you marching terror, and we're gonna get Wendy a bow. I'm gonna keep her an archer, at least for now. Uh. fight probably at level five. I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up. Started stance. Let's go with lethal stance. Speaking of Canadian Greece, here's Sam. Scalding friend, put that on her, much better. And I guess we're keeping you for now, Camellia. Ah. 
All right, sweet. Move out. Oh, she's still dead. Damn, I thought she'd be brought back. That sucks. Means we're gonna have to use a skill on her. You know what? We don't need her. What do we need her for? Does explain why we've been failing everything that she's good at, though. All right, let's go sell and see how much money we can make. I'd rather use a scroll. Eh, I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? No, it doesn't. Not really. negative level so that's good I wonder if they're ever going to give us enough scrolls to make uh, sense here in act one probably not um, restoration scrolls Nope, it's still only three. You know, little. Uh, do not appreciate that, owl cat. Do not appreciate that. All right, let's go grab Woldriff real quick. Head on. And we'll get our charisma bonus uh, headpiece. I lead, you follow. Oh, sorry, Greg. No, I was not planning on a full mercenary party. We have done that before. I was not planning on it, but uh, while we were building that mercenary, I was thinking, and Cheat, quit. what's it to you, Delvin? Dumb, dumb. We might, you we might end up with a bit of a mercenary heavy party. No one told me I had to shut my well, Jeff. <laughs> Don't you listen to him? Che That's easy. <laughs> I... He was caught thieving. Because I think I want to replace Camellia with a better shaman, because Spirit Hunter is like the worst freaking shaman or second worst or something archetype. Um. I definitely don't like it anyways. So I think maybe we're going to replace her with a wildland shaman. Onwards. And then we're going to get a priest. And then we're going to have a dare. So we might only have, we might only have one non-mercenary. Yeah, we might only have one non-mercenary in the party by the time it's over. <laughs> that's, that's very possible. All right. Yeah, we gotta hit the buttons or the levers. Move out. Hmm. Level Windowog in the Child of the Manticore. Uh, I guess she does have pretty good stats for it so maybe Head on. I guess it'll depend on how overpowered child of the manticore ends up being I think it's my second favorite at this point since raid shaper did not um, 
did not live up to the hype I had in my head about it. Void Train, huh? What type of game is that, Sam? Nathan just purchased 32 two liter Diet Cokes from Costco. Yes, sir, you do definitely have a problem. That is nuts. Sixty-four liters of Diet Coke. Yeah, I would say you have a problem. It's alright though. We accept you with problems and all. Also, what's up, Nathan? It's been a while, so good to see you. Guess we don't really have anything to sell that matters. Uh, but we do definitely want to talk to him about that. That's cool. Equip. Guess that's going on her. Actually, let's put it on the skull. Yes, Nathan is ready for the apocalypse because when it comes, all you need is Diet Coke to survive. I mean, it's got everything you need. It's got vitamins and nutrients and calories. No, wait, it doesn't have any of those things, does it? Um, oh, it's got caffeine. It's got caffeine. You don't know how to classify it? Okay. Well, drop the link to it in the Discord and uh, the video that you watched, and maybe I'll check it out later. You know, drop it in the Discord, maybe a lot of people will check it out. Onwards. Onwards. Void train. I don't know. Never heard of it. All right, come well, on, you chief. Whatever what do you, you got are. for me? That's easy. You know, Irabeth. That's easy. You know. <laughs> oh di wow! We went all the way up there and we forgot to talk to Irabeth. Hooray! Good job. My memory is like a steel trap. Move out. I freaking hit my funny bone or whatever that nerve is that's there in your elbow that people like to call the funny bone um earlier today like harder than i've ever hit it before in my life like my fingers are still numb it's not like totally numb but still have like a little bit of a numb sensation and they've got like this pain in my knuckles it was um it was not the best of times i guess is the, the point i'm trying to make 
Demons have been filling Canabras with their spies and infiltrate. Come on, Anevia, give me the rest of your quest. I think that's all the quests here, pretty sure. I'm very much so looking forward to going back into time and just seeing how the Sarkorians were in the past. I would imagine they were probably pretty prejudiced against shifters, given their their thoughts on mages. Um, well, chief, you're sure but I guess we'll have to see. Now. As far as whole room goes, you follow. That dude's just a jackass. He doesn't like anybody. I'm sure that includes his mother and his children. Get on the move. It's just that the Costco closest to me doesn't carry the two liters, so I have to drive an extra 15 minutes to another Costco to buy them. So you bought a bunch. All right. Makes sense. Makes sense. I mean, if, if you have the room and the money, then sure, why not? Yeah, let's see how annoying this is. Anything but sure. Anything but sure. Anything but sheer. Anything but sheer. Do not sheer fear. Do not waver. Yeah. I'm trying to sneak up behind us. That's not cool. Good for you, Malphus. That is awesome. From soda to bubbly water. I've also recently stopped drinking soda mostly. I mean, I still drink like one or two a week, but you know, over the last several weeks, like that's that's been it, just one or two a week. I was drinking like one or two a day, so bit of an improvement. And, yep. Becoming diabetic definitely sucks, Yomogami. 
Sorry to uh, to hear that. I suppose Nathan is with with the diet sodas, so I don't think that diabetes is a problem. Although I'm sure they're still not great for your health. Sister Kiris May. Fine, we'll find the traitor. I already know who it is. It's you. It's always you. No, not you. 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 Anyways, let's go. So now you drink uh, two liters of Dr. Pepper Cherry Zero Yomogami. I mean, I actually used to drink Diet Dr. Pepper and thought it was pretty good. And then, like, uh, they had some Dr. Pepper that was, like, only 10 calories that I thought was pretty good. But I don't know. The older I get, the more or the less good fake sugar tastes to me. Like... Whenever I was in my 20s, Let me draw the first um, like the fake sugar, I could tell there was a difference in taste, but like the difference was fine. Like Diet Dr. Pepper was every bit as good as regular Dr. Pepper whenever I was in my 20s. Now I drink it and it's like, ugh, like I can't, I don't know. Sucks getting old, I guess. Into the fray. Ugh. The light take you. Ha! Oh, <laughs> that was great. Forty five, really? Hell yeah, Virexa! By the way, that was the name of the first evil character I ever made in an RPG, Virexa. No reason to pause. Rely on me. I've, I've had the zero version Jomogami and like I used to think they were good and now they're just like eh. the the 10 calorie version I don't know what they do different with that that's definitely the best one but it's still just not that good I'd rather just drink tea and water and milk which is almost the only things I have been drinking lately. Very little else. The cherry might might actually make it better, like maybe it'll cover up the sugar taste or the lack of sugar taste or uh, help hide it or something. It's possible. Could help. I like cherry Pepsi. Move out. Nah, I didn't want to heal my party. That was intentional, unlike the times in the shield maze that wiped us. Head down! Head down! Yeah, 
If any drink's main ingredient was cocaine, I, lead, I would be buying follow. more of that than Nathan bought of his uh, Diet Dr. Pepper earlier. Much, much more. So I don't think it's cocaine. What am I doing here? Uh, right, Sam wanted us to heal, so we're going to acquiesce and um, I guess take Sam's advice. That's probably a good idea. Hopefully, whenever we're at the end of this playthrough, we'll be able to say the only deaths we had were prior to the water elemental and the shield maze. And if we want that to be the case, we should probably heal right now, like Sam suggested. Wish that were true, Yomogami. If it is, it, and... I can confirm it. Maybe I'll be retiring to Central America instead of the Philippines. We'll have to see. Hello? Is anyone there? Huh? What's that? Hey, get me out of here! Probably not. Probably not, actually. I don't think I could feel as safe there as I could in the Philippines. Hello? So scratch that. Onwards. Is anyone there? No, nobody's here. All right. Quit screaming like a bitka. Pay attention. Yes, but in the Philippines, they're much more localized and they have their own islands. And they'll be very far away from where I am. In Central America, I have no freaking clue where they're at. I am helpful, am I not? Save the last one Die! for me. Rip you apart! Come on, we need your experience. Sacrifice yourself for the good of the cause. That nine experience is gonna be the difference between life and death at some point. Move out! Now let's go. I'm losing my temper. All oh, right, we need you. Free. That's right, huh. Finny and Dismar. See how long it's been since we played this? I freaking almost like forgot a, to pick up Finny. There are demons in Kanawha. Like I was really about to just I leave. I swear. That that um. Yeah, it's been too long, people. Been too long. Okay, you already have that. Let's. Yeah, you have your claws, so you don't really need a weapon. So yeah, I guess we're giving it to her. Which is cool. Um, what is it? Composite, right? Yeah, composite longbow. That's what we want. Bam. We probably should give her some armor, though. Although she has so much dexterity that...
Yeah, I guess that's fine. Does Finian have claw tips? I don't think so. Unless that's something they've changed. Are you telling me to use Finian claw tips? Or are you just saying that you would like for them to be added? What the hell? Whatever. Apparently we didn't ask the gnome the right questions, so that's my bad. Oh, well, that's pretty crazy. World War II was a crazy time. Did you watch the one about the Japanese guy who was on the island still fighting the war for like 30 years after it ended? That was pretty crazy. No, I've never attacked her before. Maybe we should just kill her. the spoils of the thieflings because we're awesome fall. like that what's that there I hope you appreciate this I wish they were added too, Greg. I do. I do be do be do. Um, what the hell? Onwards. Oh, really? We don't have the perception to see that? Y'all don't let me forget to come back here later when we can see that wall. We passed the freaking checks that we needed to and then we can't see the, the wall. The uh, secret hidden wall. Anyways. Door, I guess I should be saying that wall. All right. Let's head back here. We'll talk up Wolgif. Oh, that. Do the pets stack? Do pet bonuses stack? That would have been a good idea. I've already left the... Alright, well I guess we'll give this to you for now. Oh, we don't have anybody with the Knowledge Arcana skill. What? Don't remember what that does exactly. Let's give it to her. That seems right. Um... And... I don't think we opened our box, so we don't have any pets. We should go back and open our box.
Alright, let's go. I believe you, Sam. I hadn't left when you typed it. I believe you. I believe you. But I've left now. Look, we got an owl cat, and I don't know how it happened, but we finally got our freaking dragon, which I think we actually talked about last time whenever we were playing the kineticist a couple weeks ago. That. But anyways, somehow we finally got our freaking dragon. Yep, that was a stack. Although, this is like the one pet that doesn't give perception, so that doesn't help very much. Mm, I want to say this helps with diplomacy checks. Is that right? I think so. Let's go back and see if we can see it real quick. Eh. I don't know. But we're going to do that after the Defender's Heart Siege Battle. Because I don't want to waste time before Head it. On. And there's not anything good in there anyways. Just stuff we're going to sell. Yeah, Dragon on the Skull is probably a good idea. Let's do that. Pretty sure the Scald has Bardic Knowledge, right? The, the one that we got has Bardic Knowledge, maybe. We didn't sacrifice that for something. Yes, yes, he does. Or, excuse me, she does. So, yeah, yeah, that's a good one to put the dragon on. Good call. Forgot the whole reason we went there was to... Uh, Listen to Akito the Geek, who was the first person in the stream after I screwed it up and had to start it over again, was the first person in the stream. And is still here because Akito the Geek is awesome. So thumbs up, like, subscribe. Really helps us out. Free way to show us some support. Definitely appreciate it. All right. Make sure you have your notification bells turned on as well because we're going to be taking this playthrough all the way through the entire game as well as all the DLCs except for Through the Ashes of course because uh, we can't play that one with this character but all the other DLCs we can and will be the first character we've done that with so make I sure that uh, you you're here for it also if you're over on Twitch give us a follow and use the link down below the video to join us on Discord alright do it join us awesome um Right, back here. That's where he is. You're awful tricksy. sure he didn't carry anything that we give a damn about so yeah whatever all right let's go onwards oh, definitely appreciate it akito <laughs> well show it is much appreciated 29 likes. That's very near our all-time high. I think our all-time high is like 32. Um, 
I know we had as many as 35 people watching earlier. I was hoping we might hit that 40 mark. I don't think we've ever hit 40 in a single stream before. So hit those like buttons and subscribe. Get this out there. Maybe we can hit 40. That'd be freaking awesome. A nice achievement. Actually, if we can manage to get it up to 40 likes during the stream or 40 viewers, either one, um, yeah, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll give away a Steam game on the, the next stream. I'll look back and see everybody who... Uh, I can't see everybody who is here, but I can see everybody who talked. So everybody who talked said anything at all during the stream. Um, we'll do a drawing and uh, we'll... Uh, we'll, we'll give away a free copy of I don't know something I don't know what it'll be a CRPG though perhaps it'll be the winner's choice if this was August I would say Baldur's Gate 3 Thanks for the gold. Now die. Oh, really? No experience? Boo. Pretty good, aren't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're kind of full of yourself. No one stands in my way. I'll prove something wrong. the voice of the spirit is there trouble together we Let's stand move already we are the, the light. spirits demand they your blood are the darkness yeah august 31st There's seems hope. like a crappy time a to release a game hustle? You know, anybody who's going to college or school or, you know, anything like that is like kind of getting boned. Why don't you have your bow in your hand? What the hell is wrong with you? The hell beg me to stop. People get out here. Studios has a good fan in you then. Yeah, I doubt it'll actually stop anybody, but it's definitely going to slow them down. I lead, you follow. Oh, and who have we here? A little murdered girl.
I'm here. Where else would I be? Yeah, Dark On Boy Quickens. does not have a solid release date yet, Sam. I did contact them, by the way. I haven't heard anything back, but I'm definitely trying to get it to where we can uh, maybe get some type of pre-release content access for the channel. Because I don't know when that's going to be. To be honest, I think it's going to be after Baldur's Gate 3. Um, so that leaves Baldur's Gate 3 as kind of the next game that I'm most looking forward to. Um, but that one's not too far behind it. coming but that's all right you know what we still got windy and she's gonna take you out I can't do the level 20 thing in Baldur's Gate 3. I can't. Like, I don't know. Maybe, uh, I don't know. Well, I don't know what the mod is. Maybe if the mod adjusts the enemy's stats and abilities accordingly, maybe then. Um, but anyways. Yeah. I think I've got over 100 hours into it. The Baldur's Gate 3 beta. I know I've had four playthroughs of it. And then like three or four partial playthroughs of it. Discover those fools! Uh oh. For me, this will leave a bruise. I'll just sit here. Damn it. Don't worry about me. This is about to get annoying. Stab 
you or zap you. Why not both? You need quickly. Really? Damn it, Wolja. Pissing me off. Have bought some mage armor potions. Damn, we don't have any. That sucks. Oh, we do have a mage armor scroll though. So maybe we can make that work. better all's well that ends well so on and so forth all that jazz What kind of damage You'll are you doing here? No more. Look at those Wolverine guys, dude. Freaking awesome. Explosions of blood everywhere. Hello, Kalesa. Nice. 
Nice, we got the bow this time. We got the bow. Don't mind me. The world is full of wonder. All right. Uh, so that should be a plus. No, that's not the right one. That there should be a plus three bow. So we're going to give that to her, and Finian can go to, I guess, anybody else. Um, not really you, not you. I guess we'll give it to Wolja for now. Oh, I will definitely be playing Starfield. I don't care how buggy it is. It's going to be amazing and awesome, and I'm sure it won't be any more buggy than you know, any normal Bethesda yeah. release. You they will break yes. against our resolve. But again, Starfield is releasing after um, Baldur's Gate 3, so... Yeah, that's a pretty good way to go with it. Distract him for me. Heard of other people using it? I think it still works, Nathan. Um, although me and Jen did not do that the last time uh, we played it, we should have to see if it still works or not. I guess. I lead, you follow. It's not particularly difficult to win that fight anyways, as long as you take the um, Mind Flayer side in the battle. But I would imagine that higher difficulties it probably will be, so hopefully it, it sticks there in the game and it'll become something like the Ring Around the Rosy with the uh, the Water Elemental that we do in the Shield Maze. Got it. You know, something like that. Wow. That eagle is cool. Look at those three foxes, and they have hats. That's freaking awesome. What's up, yo? Nice of you to stop by. And Neurok 5 as well. Definitely appreciate y'all. Be sure to give us a follow if you're liking what you're seeing. We're going to be here streaming this uh, just about every day until we complete it. They choose to stand against me? Yeah, you take the Mind Flayer's side, you kill the Cambion, and then you kill the Mind Flayer. But you take the Mind Flayer's side first. Out of my way! Into the fray! And the doing light. that, it's Thank not too difficult. Ah, oh, crap. Everybody still has ranged weapons, that's not good. Pay attention, guy. Pay attention. Oh, 
your fault. Why am I Why the hell are you all just down? sitting back there? What the balls? That's annoying. Hello? Frickin' really? Alright, I'm pissed at you two. Excuse. Yeah, that was annoying. You deserve my obedience. What's on your I mind? I'll help where I can. I wonder. First blood. Die! Let's hear you cry! Uh, well, we talked about Mythic Paths, Jim, and um, almost definitely Demon, unless somebody can give me some really good persuasive reason not to go Demon. But yeah, we're pretty much going demon. That's, that's basically what's happening here. There is a chance that we may parlay demon into legend at the beginning of Act 5. Yeah, get your ass out of here. Hey, thanks, Yomogami. Hope that uh, you, uh, that you're feeling better. Um, that things have been going better for you there. Probably a good thing that you're getting to bed. So, yeah, definitely get some sleep. And uh, maybe we'll see you on tomorrow. Nice, we're up to 35 peeps. Hells yeah, only five more, five more needed. All right, hit your like and subscribe buttons. All right, gonna be giving away a game tomorrow if we get up to 40 likes and or 40 viewers, so. Make sure you put something in the chat though, all right? Because unless you subscribe today or put something in the chat, I won't have any way to enter you into the um, drawing to see if you want. Move out. So even if it's just hi or bye or whatever. I am yours to command. You're going to stinking cloud your own damn people if you're going to stinking cloud. Oh no, not you. Not you. Match 
for me. Time to share your treasures. back on. Go murder them, people. Go murder them. That looked like some kind of little Seder to y'all or something. Huh. I don't know. At your Just discretion. An antler helm, I guess. Now, what is that? We will definitely be taking the Midnight Arrow, for sure. Oh, Shizzle. That is done. I lead, you follow. I guess we should go find the uh, Thieflings as well while we're here. I remember the first time I played this game in the beta. Um, the the very reason that they they put the messenger that we ran into and killed whenever we first entered the Market Square area here. The, the, the whole reason they put that there is because of me, or well, not really me, but people like me. The first time that I ever played this during the beta, like I did absolutely everything and could not figure out how to get into the Great Garrison. I was going back and searching like every area, every place in Canabras. And yeah, I needed to find these people and somehow I'd missed them. All right, so tell me a good story, bro. And, I would like um, some time to it was collect a good story. myself. And I hope you all enjoyed it. Yes, you're going to help me, all right. More than you'll ever know. Oh, damn, we're fatigued. I think we can win a battle even if we're fatigued, right? Although on hard difficulty, this is kind of freaking dangerous to be going around uh, assuming things like that. The hell, beg me to retreat stop. already. Come on, Wolverine! That's what we should have named the character. We should have named it Wolverine. Did not realize that the shifter was going to have Wolverine claws, though. So. I did not, uh. Name her that. Don't worry about me. Logan, yeah, Logan would have worked too. Although I guess we'd have, especially if we named him Logan, we'd have had to go with a male character instead of female. 
What's that? Fancy Pants Darren wants us to come save him? No, I don't think we will. Head on. Hello, Robin. All right, let's grab our tiger. Suppose we should put these on somebody, huh? Sorry, I was trying to remember what I came in here for. And that was it. Where do you want me? I think it's probably time to rest. Let's go ahead and do that. Or not in here, I guess. Even though it seems like a much safer area than outside. But whatever. of wisdom. Wow. All right, <laughs> let's go on battling demons. Damn. Don't let me forget to buy mage armor potions whenever we go back to the uh, uh, Defender's Heart. Cover me, alright? You can handle them. Right? future awaits us. 
All right, this next fight might be a little bit difficult. Pretty good chance it will be. of other ways to up our AC here now, do we? There we go. That should work. You can trust me. would I be? I'll cheer you on from over there. Yeah. Not sure how bright my bright idea was. We need to go turn base because if not, we're going to stand up and die, and that's going to end it. Some... There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Stab you or zap you? Why not both? for me. Yeah. Ah, kill is 
Oh, nice, Windy. Hell yes. Good job, Windwag. Nice to have somebody here who's worth a damn. Finish them off, Wendy. So close. So close. Nice. You fell. You are done for, guy. Goodbye. Woo -woo. All right. Hell yeah. A simple smile goes a long way. Where are you at, My tail is restless. Yeah, Nurok 5. That Babao is got to be the hardest one in the game. Although I'll say in the Treasure of the Midnight Isles DLC, there are some pretty ridiculously tough Babao in there as well. Um, yeah, kind of nuts how tough I they made some you. of them. Oh, something. Um, anyways, let's see here. I'm losing my temper. I suppose I wasn't actually expecting Together, that to work. We stand. Adventures are exciting. Don't think anybody actually needs that spear. Is that a one handed spear? This group right here is kind of a pain in the ass, as I do recall. You know what? They're actually a lot easier to take down if we come at them from the other way. So let's do that. Let's do that. If we come at them from this other side, they should go down much more readily. This is my kind of work. Anything for you. Move out! You offend me. I'll prove I they will break against oh, our damn resolve. It. I don't want turn based anymore. Go get them, people. No Go get them. match for me. Dude, that 
freaking explosion is so awesome. So awesome. I love it. I love it. Out of my way! Let's kill it. I can't die now. I'm not nearly rich enough. <laughs> I am helpful, am I not? I am. Head on. Over there. I am helpful, am I not? Dio Jazz is joining us and wants to know how much have we enjoyed the game so far. Well, we had some hiccups in the beginning, I which is you follow. why our death counter sadly reads three. Um, but I guess that's what happen when, happens whenever you play on high difficulties and you haven't played the game in a long time. But anyways, we're rolling pretty well now. And it's been a lot of fun. We've got some Wolverine claws that are being quite effective. Definitely enjoying those. I uh, don't think we're go going to actually get to see anything beyond the shifter. Or see any part of the DLC beyond the shifter, I guess I should say. Um, until we reach Act 3. And I do not know this. And maybe somebody else does know this. I haven't heard, though. But I suspect Act, Act 3 is when we'll, we'll be able to actually go back in time to old Sarkoria. Um, so we probably won't actually get to see much of the DLC besides the shifter until then. But in this playthrough, we've decided that we're going to actually do the entirety of the Midnight Isles DLC, Inevitable Access, and The Last Sarkorians. So... It'll be the first playthrough that we've completed all DLCs and the base game with. So hopefully the shifter kicks ass, because if not, that's going to be about 100, 120 hours. That's maybe not the most fun if um, we're not enjoying the shifter. But so far, fairly confident we will be. Uh, yes, Nurok 5. This is the first DLC that you cannot play on its own. It is not a standalone. It's only accessible through the main story. The other DLCs have either been, you know, standalones or they've been both. You know, you can access them through the main story or as standalone. Open your heart to me. Yeah, I know you're no around here, you pause. little clucker. No time for idling. This is not going to be an easy <sighs> fight either. No one stands in my way. Damn, do my claws? I'm not sure. Can my claws do anything to a spirit? Probably not. DR, eh, well, we can bypass. Yeah, I think we should be able to hurt it then for bypassing cold iron, magic, and silver. Pretty sure one of those is, well, we're going to find out. I'm pretty sure one of those should allow us to hit it. Let's move already. Ask nicely. Is there trouble? Dude, I saw that, the freaking dragon coming, and I was like, what the hell did they add in here? Thought it was like some giant snake or something. Anyways, that was that was a little creepy. I'm not going to lie, that was a little creepy. Um, 
Let's go ahead and flush this thing out. Be right there, right? Pretty sure. If we can actually cast it. Oh my Bob, come on. Okay, Dila, you suck. Just want to make that clear right now. Friendship lasts forever. Forever. Uh. Don't do this to me now. Oh my god. Use magic devices plus 10. What the hell? got to cast in a minute, right? Eventually. I mean, all we have to do is roll a freaking... There it is, finally. Damn. Into the fray. Closer than I wanted it to be to us, though. That sucks. That definitely sucks. Don't know how long you're gonna make it. So much. Stand down. The light. Uh, potions, potions everywhere. Potions, potions have no hair. Potions, potions I do declare. There's the potions. bit of damage on him. Hey! Oh, crap. You're attacking the wrong one. Didn't realize it was attacking you. It's annoying. It's just going to keep switching from one to one to one. What the hell? Don't do that crap. Using ice, right? Let's throw on our aspect. See if we can't. Uh... Well, that's... 
So I want to see that. Mm. So, hell yeah. All right. Our dragon form is finally good for something. It's cutting out all the cold damage this shadow demon's doing. Hooray, hooray. Dragon aspect, good for something. All right. Let's get back to the battle. What the hell? I did not tell you to move, you jackass. Die! Don't mind just killing this thing already, please. Kill me quickly. Good job, guy. Not using freebooters baying like a... That was not very smart. Quickly! Oh my god, there's way too many potions. I mean, the trickster is like the best path. I don't know. It, it was the path I immediately wanted to go to, um, like mechanics-wise, for the shift, for the shifter, the trickster. But I don't know. I want to do something different. We've done so many trickster builds um, and playthroughs, and the trickster is just so damn good. Um, I don't know. Wanted to do something different. And I think we can get a pretty ridiculous abomination of a character with the demon mythic path here, too. Or the legend. So. Here's hoping we're right about that. Onwards. I just can't. Hey, Norlin for you. Yeah, reminds me of my combat roles uh, in our Pathfinder uh, campaign stream. Dude, I was freaking rolling like, well, not necessarily just the combat, but I was rolling like fours and sixes and eights for the vast majority of the night. I hope you appreciate this. was not great. This. was not great. It was hella fun, though. It was hella fun. We're having another one this Friday night. Um, so... Anybody who's interested, anybody who wants to have a good time, come by Friday night uh, for our PF2E campaign stream. Yeah, Trickster Faye does sound pretty mad. Like a Faye would be a trickster anyways, like regardless, right? So yeah. I do not believe Limitless Rage works with the Demon's Rage. I'm actually not sure. I haven't played it a whole lot either. I know for sure at one point it did not, but that seems like something that they should have changed by now. So I feel like there's a good chance it's actually changed since um, I've done any Demon builds or anything, which has been a pretty good long while. Move 
All right, let's go hit up the library because we need to. Uh, we need to get those peeps on our side before the uh, Defender's Heart Siege Battles Battle pops for sure. No time for idling. Something wrong. I'm losing my temper. Damn. We use way too freaking many potions, people. Can't believe we're out of potions. We're gonna have to start making better use of grease and some CCs. No, I don't want to rest. I want to go to the damned library. Let's go. Mm. Is this Ninio? I hope it's Ninio and not the Defender's Heart siege happening already. Shouldn't be the Defender's Heart yet. We've only rested once. It's Ninio. All right, so I guess we're gonna go ahead and rest again here. Screw it, let's do it. Well, the demon actually, by the way, Greg, is pretty might amazing. Be might be treasure. I've not played a martial demon character. I really had a martial demon build. But as a caster, they're freaking phenomenal. Um, and I expect that this shifter is going to be pretty damn powerful too. You can just get so many bonuses and attacks, um, so many stat bonuses and attack uh, alterations and attack bonuses that I'm expecting it to be really, really good. So hopefully it is. And if it's not, we've always got legend to fall back on. Because I know for damn sure it's going to be awesome as a legend. Oh. Well, we picked a great time to go camping, huh? That's pretty amazing. Come on, there should be a sword over here. And that's what we want. There it is. Head on. Wow, we are way freaking overweight. Okay. Yeah, the teleporting charge is pretty abusable. Baphomet um, Simone, an audience. Oh, problematic, but actually, not critical. Actually, you there, um, girl. Stay out of this. I have made a demon tank, and that is pretty awesome. And the charge is one of the best parts about it. Who's that? Because you can just her. build for straight defense and absolutely nothing else, and then that demon charge can just kind of be your damage. And it's not super great damage, but it's really reliable damage. Very few things can actually like resist it, or are immune to it um works wonders against swarms and like really good against swarms greetings boys and she look who so oh, i guess i should have said i haven't made a melee they don't matter. DPS consider them a supplementary as a component of the coming but experiment thumbs up demon for as a tank or as a caster they're definitely really good in those those two areas in the name let we will not I'll look wrong that is this a yep and a cow none of your act it appears damn it hey take it easy we've only is the please <sighs> be hey the ex come at me i dare you not gonna help us huh with the problem you created yeah that sounds like ninio ninio oh we probably should have buffed ourselves though that would have been good 
The Inheritor, guide oh. my blade! is statistically predictable especially what about you red and gold are the colors of baphomet i am it seems to me that i owe you an explanation my name is it is unfortunately yes unable to i apologize do you wish truth be told i have no money to pay you but you will be aiding the progress of science and huh? your for Show of hands, who hates the Ninio quest line? Uh, ask Zachary Heflin. Yeah, I think they go a little overboard on the puzzles as well. Um, but at least for the most part, at least the most annoying ones are all optional. So that's good. see we still have people kind of cycling in and out going up and down oh one second i'm gonna take a quick look oh we still need seven more likes for the giveaway people so if you're new here if you haven't liked the stream yet give us a like all right if we get to 40 likes or 40 viewers at any time then we're going to do a giveaway tomorrow any game um that you want off steam um, well, any game that's 60 bucks or less, I don't know. Maybe they have some games that are more than that. Um, you know, do the drawing tomorrow. Let y'all know on stream tomorrow who wins. Let's try to get it up to 40 likes, though. We need to get there with 40 likes or 40 viewers. Also, type something in the chat so that I have something to reference um, to drop your name in the hat for the drawing. If that's something you're interested in. No. Really? You're giving us this already? Crap. That means we're going to lose our wizards. Oh, I hate you. I fucking hate you. Run them through! So 
gonna start us in combat too, huh? Just like that. Damn it. All right. I don't know where Ulbrig is activated at. If Ulbrig is activated there, then maybe we'll get to see a little more of the uh, DLC than we thought, earlier than we thought. That might be cool. We don't talk to him, we can probably just leave, right? Leave. Damn it. What do you think? Should we go back to the tavern or not? I think we have to. I think if we don't, the tavern gets destroyed. Which. I mean, we don't have to. We could let the tavern get destroyed. Um, Yeah, the... The thing is, if the Defender's heart gets destroyed, then I don't think we can save the Wizards anyways. Because the Wizards are... You have to get to them before the Defender's heart battle. So I don't think we can save them either way. Fine, let's go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. But you're right, Greg. Not not caring about the tavern does seem kind of one brand. <laughs> All right, we should at least have some time to rest. And we're going to purchase some potions because I'm sure we're going to need those. 
Um, not going to get a cheesy scroll, but we probably will use some cheesy um, grease. Or maybe some greasy cheese. I don't know. Which way do you think sounds better? Probably greasy cheese. Excuse me. Grab a couple of those, sell all that. Alright, we want to equip the wicked longbow on somebody, pretty sure. Ah, no! That's not for you, that's for me. Half plate plus one. We need to put that on Sila. We need to put the leather on somebody. Okay. So let's keep that too. Maybe we'll throw that on Windowog. I don't know. We'll see. Just thinking out loud. Might be worth it though. your spell book that is trash we'll take that out yeah let's go with that that'll work what about our scald friend here right spontaneous and Ninio, we're. Don't think we're actually bringing you to battle, Ninio. So you don't don't really matter. Although your pit could be helpful. Nah, I don't think I don't think she matters. You go, Miss Scaldy Pants. Move out. I'll speak to you. I have a quest. Not much experience, but it's better than nothing, I suppose. Junkie, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? How you doing? Um, the DLC, the only thing you're seeing in this stream so far that the DLC has is the shifter. I don't know. I think these spells are part of the update and not part of the DLC. I think. Uh, could be wrong about that though. Um, the shifter is definitely part of the DLC, and Old Brig, whenever we get there, is part of the DLC, but I don't think anything else that we've shown on stream tonight is part of the DLC. That's funny, Greg. Greg likes the tavern fight much better now that he has uh, discovered the power of our Lord and Savior, Greece. Pretty awesome. I don't know. I bought the season pass. It's 28 bucks, and you get all the DLC that they're doing this year. I, I don't know. Probably three of them. You know, so you get like three DLCs for like 28, 29 bucks. It's, it, it's worth it. Even if it was just the shifter class, well, maybe just the shifter class wouldn't be worth the eight or nine bucks that it comes out to, whatever. Um, but certainly the story uh, along with that would be. Um, but yeah, it's 
definitely a lot more expensive if you just buy the DLC only. Yeah, I've tried using some scrolls on the gates, and one time we wiped our party doing that, and so I just I just stick to what I know will work. Some simple greases. Doesn't even matter if it's on unfair. Grease is all you need to, to win this battle without too much difficulty. Um, I know some other things can make it in, even far simpler, but... Um, I don't know. Well, maybe not far simpler, but uh, far easier. Head but I like on. to keep it just simple with the grease. Shouldn't be any kind of issue. I like Windowog more, but if you're talking mechanically, oh, sword, maybe me my not. Sins. I am. I mean, she's definitely not going to get as many attacks as Land. Probably not do as much damage as him. More versatile though, and she's much more interesting as a party member. All right, party people, uh, before we get this started, we're going to have a three-minute intermission. I need to go take a bio break and maybe grab a drink or something. So give me three, four minutes tops, and I'll be back, and we will hit this Defender's Heart uh, siege battle pretty hard. See how Wolverine uh, and our, her claws do against this thing. Be right back.
All right, we are back. I do apologize for the wait. All right, but let's go ahead and get this big ass siege battle uh, going. Should be a ton of fun. Definitely one of my favorite battles in the game. I was freaking stoked, like excited, like gaga over this battle whenever I first played it in the beta. Um, um, Strand of the Tangled Knot should be a new spell on Camellia. I haven't actually looked at it, but um, I'm fairly confident that that is not a spell that she had before. So, yeah, I'm going to say that that's a new one. Throwing Axe Windowog is freaking awesome, Greg. Definitely, definitely awesome. And let's see... Uh, And HunchP40D says that if you min max Lin and Windowog together, then uh, Windowog wins out unless you have legendary proportions on Lin. And a 30 foot archer just <laughs> feels wrong. A 30 foot archer does kind of feel wrong, I suppose. And if you're going to put legendary proportions on him can you just put it on Windowog and it would be kind of null there dude we just slept what the fuck we just slept that annoys me gonna attack maybe thank you the spirits demand your blood stab you or zap you why not both What the hell?
sure. Your time is over. I'll rip you on that. those potions at oh really you're gonna turn around and go back like a bitch all right fine I guess Anything good we can do here? Right? Well, 
not good. Not, not good. Look at all this grease we have here, and they're just like freaking ignoring it. Yeah, we should have uh, specialized a little more in grease, I guess. Sweet, all right, the shears down, that is good. Let's hear you cry. Stand down. Away, you rascal! don't think we're gonna win this fight unfortunately those fucking clouds kicked our ass if we could have stopped those clouds we would have been okay but we didn't we didn't Hang out back here. No, we can't. We're just gonna stop the fires. Damn it. There's no way we can stop those fires either, is there? Go for their hearts! I took a cave slug for a foe. Wide open! for me. All right, let's see what we can do here. See what we can do. Can we get somebody back up on their feet, preferably Sila, because once she went down, that's when it all went wrong. We gotta get a better tank. Sila's just not a very good tank. Gotta see if we can do that. The spirits demand your blood. Oh, 
Okay. I don't know if they're going to come for us or not. If they do, then we're definitely dead. If they don't, then maybe we can manage. Maybe. You are today's sacrifice. Go for their hearts. Come on, Wendy. There's too many fires going out there, isn't there? Yeah, there is. Damn it. Are you? They'll beg me to stop. No match for me. I'll rip you apart. Can't uh can't get by that. Yeah, we're we're screwed. They'll beg me to stop. Well, it seems we would have done better no not to come back, people. Sure, now we get level four. Would have been nice to have level four before that. What the fuck? Yeah, sometimes it be like that, Zachary. Sometimes it doesn't go well. That's only the second time I've ever lost that battle. Well, that's not true. It's only the second time I've lost the battle since beta. Like the first two times I fought it, then I lost. But then I like kept on playing it until I won. <laughs> That's not what we're doing now. Not what we're doing now. Level four. What did we get at level four? I'm curious. Jack shit. That's what we got at level four. All right, cool. Don't really care too much about you, Ninio. Or you, Ember. Why don't you stop clicking on characters we don't care about? We're getting blur. That would have helped. Yeah, I can't believe we did that at level three. What the hell? It's been a long 
We always hit level four before that. That was just weird. Guess we should have went to the Tower of Estrid first. Or gone to the library before we rested. Something like that. Definitely would have been better. Mm. You know, it's kind of eh. Probably not going to be using you for too much longer anyways, so... No one stands in my way. Definitely going with archery. Yeah. Guess it doesn't really matter much since you already have precise shot, though. Oh, and we already took rapid shot. Damn it. We shouldn't have taken rapid shot. I forgot it was going to be here. That's annoying. That is annoying. Wolgefi, Wolgefi, Wolgefi. Okay, let's see here. What buffs can we grab? Because buffs are really what we kind of need. Let's grab Scorching Ray. Best buff in the game, right? And... We'll take a Cat's Grace. Oh, we're up to 30s. Seven people watching. That is freaking phenomenal, guys.
thanks everybody for you know being here hanging out 37 if we can get three more let's get the 40 we'll have that drawing give away a game all right or if we can get the 40 likes so if you haven't liked the stream yet like it like it okay like it subscribe we're going to be streaming this every day until we complete it or damn near every day so make sure that you are subscribed to the channel so that you don't miss uh how it all goes Mm -mm -mm -mm. Ah, no. oh, we forgot to. That would have helped too. We forgot to put on Sila's new armor. So that's unfortunate. And I was actually thinking about throwing someone Windowog as well. Maybe not. It's only one more AC. And I don't think one more AC is actually worth. No, actually, it's four more. I would have swore she was at 20. Well, hell, if she's getting four from it, then. 21. 21. Let's throw in the leather. Yeah, that's better. everybody for coming and hanging out um i think we are going to go ahead and end the stream here you know sorry about that but i've got to get up early in the morning to take my son to a specialist hopefully they don't have bad news so you know fingers crossed hopefully not uh we will be back uh, streaming this again tomorrow we'll pick up here and we should be able to finish the rest of act one tomorrow hopefully we meet ulbrig and we uh, get everything done that we need to do. Maybe we get a little bit of the DLC in. I don't know. We'll be meeting Olbrig, so possibly we learn a little bit there. Um, but we should definitely be completing Act 1 tomorrow. So thank you, everybody. Uh, I think this has been the most watched stream we've ever had. So you guys are awesome for helping make that, uh, make that happen. Okay, and hopefully I'll see you all back here again tomorrow evening. Um, so, yeah, thanks, everybody. This has been Chris with Laura Spire. Be well, my friends. Hey, I would like to say thank you, Internet Andy. You have a good night as well. And Zachary and Matt and Hunch for or Hunch P four D D Technolo Junkie Ashu Um Greg Malfus. I know that there are a lot more of you out there who have not been talking in the, uh, the chat, so thank all of you as well. You guys rock. Kick ass. All right. Hopefully I'll see you all tomorrow afternoon.